let's continue. Okay, so this is our factory from yesterday. Um, and for people who maybe are new to the game, I'll do like a brief, um, a brief rundown while I'm refueling these guys. But basically these turrets are what's protecting us against the insect hordes that are going to be attacking us. I'm refilling them with ammo. And then the stuff in the middle is our uh, actual buildings that we've been making. Um, a very important set of those is, if we can zoom in a little bit, are these guys. These are my little science, I call it science juice. These are the labs. Um, wait, I just realized they have names. Remwald Librod. <laughs> what? <laughs> um, oh, wait, hold on. I'm re so this, oh, sorry, I'm, I just need to switch this. I'm researching the wrong thing. Get this out of here. We can't make this yet. Okay. Um, yeah. So anyway, now, now the labs are labulating and they're doing their thing. But yeah, we're gathering resources from the ground here. Like this is stone. This is copper. Um, and then the and then this is iron. And these little things are like mining it. And then it's like going on these conveyor belts. And then these little machines are like grabbing the iron off of here. And then some coal for fuel, which is the black one and they're converting it into these iron plates. And then the iron plates are coming down here and are being converted into ammo, gears, conveyor belts, science juice circuits, and all sorts of stuff. And this game has all, all this attack. Oh, gosh. Oh, get him. Okay, good. All these guys are fine. Um, yeah, so. Oh, electronics finished already. Um, sure, fast inserters. I'm just doing some researching while I'm waiting here. Um, let's see, DLC is increasing the complexity of the game. Yeah, that's what I want. That's what I figured. Um, Carl here is barely past tutorial content. Yeah, very much so. Um, yeah. Okay, so anyway, um, the goal right now is to get the third tier of uh, research because getting more research is very important for us. Um, and then the, th and the third tier of research involves uh, this these military science packs. So we got green science juice, red science juice. We need black science juice. <laughs> In order to do that, though, we need to make these be this better ammunition. And this better ammunition is going to be very helpful anyway for defending our base. So getting the piercing rounds is important to get next. Um, I just realized I have a ton of crap in my inventory. Let me go get some of this stuff out of my inventory. Oh, I also want these walls. And these walls. Uh, I think I have a chest that I can just stuff stuff in over here. Yeah, let's put this coal in here. Um... Okay, what materials am I going to need for this? We need um, we need to make steel plates. Okay, so we're gonna have to have a, we're gonna have to make some more stone furnaces. So let's snag some stone while we're here. Probably not that much, but whatever. Let's make some stone furnaces. Uh, there we go. I probably don't need that many, but maybe we'll use them later. Probably use them later. So some tricky thing that I've been trying to understand a little bit better in this game is how to. Um, how to actually like give yourself room to expand. Oh my God, there's a massive army coming over here, by the way. Let me just go take care of that. Whoa. <laughs> all right, these guys are all fueled up now. Yeah, that was fine though, that was fine. Okay, um, welcome Pickle, welcome Delta. The turrets seem too loud or is it just me? They definitely can be pretty loud. I wonder if you can, um, I wonder if there's like a sound specifically for that. Game effects probably. So you could turn specifically that down if you wanted to. Um, but it's only really loud I think when like when you're kind of standing right next to them and they're blowing everything up. It, honestly, it's good to be able to hear them because <laughs> it could be very bad things are happening if that happens. I was binging your YouTube, hoping to catch you live. Welcome. I'm trying to pause the game so nothing happens while I'm reading chat. Um, yeah, okay. So our goal here is to be able to set up some furnaces for steel and I don't th I've, I've left myself more room But I still don't think I've left myself enough room <laughs> necessarily uh, Let's get more research coming better automation. is good. Let's see I can either put them right here or right here. I wonder if I can make this work because Let's see if we make we're gonna have to combine 
Um, copper plates, steel plates, and firearms. I got my firearms right here. We could... We're gonna have some space. I've got a little bit of space right here. Maybe by the labs there's some space. The problem with getting more space is getting annihilated by the bugs. Um, but yeah, I gotta do this where the iron is. So let's see if I can figure out a way to do it right here. And I need, I need to do it where the coal is too. I think one of these two places. I'm gonna put it here. This might be a mistake. But we are gonna try, we're gonna try putting it here. So. Let's start by making six, um, six things of these. Let's see. So, oh wait, I don't think I brainolated this super well, did I? Because I actually need to make the plates again then. Hmm, well I need more plates anyway though, so one way or another I'm gonna use these plates. I want the plates anyway. Okay, is there then room to take these and this is where we start making spaghetti. <laughs> is there room to take these and just put them into another smelter? Because if the iron plates get smelted again, then it makes the steel, uh, the steel plates. Um, will this work or not? Stay tuned. I have no idea. Gotta connect the power lines. Everything's working. Oh yeah, and I need to get coal. Maybe I just use long and a long inserter to grab the coal from here. Um, this one won't work. Okay, let's start with five and just see if that works. Uh, if I power you guys, then this should work. How am I going? Um, Definitely haven't thought this through necessarily. I need to put a space between these. I need to put a space between these or it won't work. Maybe this will work? Oh, uh, actually, I think this one's not gonna... Heck. <laughs> this is going horribly. The last furnace was fine where it was, at least I thought. Here, let me let me get let's get these going and then I'll see. I don't think it will work, but I might have miss I might have uh I might be missing something. Wait, maybe this would be okay. Okay, so now these long arms are grabbing the coal and putting in here. Those guys are grabbing that. And I'm going to have regular inserters. Um I'm gonna keep researching useful stuff while we're here, by the way. Just lab research speed sounds good. Let's get that one. Um, you still need a long, oh, this guy's in the wrong place now. You need a long arm to fill you up. Okay, and then you, um, I gotta make some more belts and inserters and useful things here. Make some more inserters. Okay, you guys are going to make a conveyor belt here, which hopefully is going to actually work, of steel plates. Okay, now we have steel plates coming in. Okay, are those all working properly right now? Um, no, you need to be right here. And there is room to make more of these. Uh, we need to get more iron probably coming in here. So before I make even more steel plates, okay, where does it, what do we need to do next? Um, now we need copper plates, steel plates, and firearms all going together. Let's see if we can find some way to do this. Oopsies. Um, build a ton of belts while I'm waiting. Let's see if we can find some way to do this. So my, f um, my firearms are right here. Let's take those. Let's see if we put those on a belt. Can this go over here? Let's see. Here comes the spaghetti. Incoming, incoming spaghetti. Um, I need to go under this. Okay, so we can use these uh, underground belts, which I should make some more of. To go under here. Oh gosh. Um, this might be bad. I need. I might need to go refill. I'm actually, I think. I think I refilled down there. Let me go run up here and make sure we're not dying. Hey, ML. Welcome in, everybody. We're back to building the spaghetti factory. <laughs> Hoping today to get some cool... Oh my god, you're almost out of ammo. 
Use Q for picking items. Yeah, I need to use that. I know about it. I just don't always forget to do it. Okay. These are my steam engines powering everything. Um, these are okay-ish. You need a little more ammo. You need a bit more ammo. Yes, welcome Europe. We're finally EU friendly. It happens every few months. Uh, okay. Just keeping everything refueled. Actually, let's check these too. You guys are a little low. Alright, you guys are all good. Everything else looks pretty good. Alright, cool. Back to what we were doing. Um, so, we have ammo here. We have our steel thingy things here. Um, okay. Maybe I just combine them like that. Or you, wait, those need to be facing up. Okay, now we have nice. And then what's the last thing we need? Uh, copper plates, which are literally right here. So... Um, Oh, let's put a splitter on the copper here. Yeah, let's put a splitter underground. Make some more stuff. Okay, let's see. We just split the copper. And then, then we have copper. That didn't work. Wait, only one goes in? That's so weird. Um, that's interesting that splitting it like that only made one of them go through. I think I can still do it if I just do like this. This. Now they both come through. Now they both come through. Okay, I need both of these things. And then somewhere over here we're going to build. I wonder if I could put it right here. Um... I need to fit in some of these assembling machines. Let's see. I think I would need two or three more spaces. Okay, this is, might be a dumb idea, but I'm gonna move this over. Might be a dumb idea. What if I move you right here? Then I have space. Then I have space. Science juice. I'm gonna have to just put this science juice in manually real fast. Um, here you go. Here you go. Oh, I need I need to be researching more things. Research lab speed. That's so nice. All oh, stronger explosives though. Oh, I can't get that one yet. Dang it. Steel axe increases your mining speed. Advanced materials processing. Sure, let's get it that one. Okay. Um, trying to get some more room here. Okay, good. You guys keep doing your thing. Now I think there's room, I hope, for, um, Cactal, uh, Caxtels. I probably misspelled, I mispronounced that, but thank you so much for the sub. Uh, now it says, I see your attempt three looks, uh, a lot more successful than attempt two. Yeah, the base is definitely better. I still don't think the base, I think I needed even more space, but it was really hard to get space because I had all the insects attacking earlier. Um, put the underground for the copper. Oh yeah. I got to use underground stuff even more. That would really help just to clear out more room. Like, these could just be broken up with underground stuff so they're not all over the place. Um, okay, we'll keep that in mind if I need some more space over here. So, my plan here is to use a long inserter and a short inserter. Um, I don't know how many of these I need. Let's get four of them. Four might be too many, but whatever. Um, let me see if this works. So, if I use a... Let's use these... Short inserters and long inserters. Um, and they and we're going to be making, uh, what is it called, this one. Yo, Sugi, thank you so much for the gift subs. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, I love watching the log inserters grab stuff. Okay, so these guys are all making stuff. 
And then I'm gonna have to move these power lines too, I just now realized, but that's okay. So they're making better ammunition, which is going to be very, very useful. I'm gonna need to move you and you. Put these here instead. And then now I need a conveyor belt going up here. Okay, cool, we got a conveyor belt of better ammunition coming in. And then I need to combine the better ammunition with grenades and walls. Here are grenades. Um, I'm gonna take some of these grenades. Grenades are extremely useful. Uh, so just having the grenades ready is actually going to, yeah, let's just do that. Um, Whoa, look at all of them. Okay, a little bit scary. A little bit scary. Green science inserter is not connected to power. Thank you. Right. Good catch. Okay, give me my green science. Um... Okay, I'm gonna let this stuff uh, pile up a little bit real quick because I think I need more iron production. Let me see. Maybe actually the iron production is not bad still. Okay, no, I think the iron production is not bad. Um, okay, I probably would need to make more of these at some point here, but so far the iron production is not terrible. Okay, so what I need to do is I need to, um, I'm gonna get rid of this, these walls. I think I have too many walls at this point. So I'm just going to get rid of these walls and then try to find some way to get some of these bricks. Uh, oh god, will this work? Now I have bricks. Bricks? Oh god, don't go into there. Okay. Oh, wait, where am I? Uh-oh. <laughs> where am I bringing these? Uh-oh. I wonder if I can go through here. Idea. Don't know if good idea, but idea nonetheless. Um. Uh. Stop it. Oh, that doesn't work. Um, maybe let me try this again. Maybe here? This is bad. <laughs> maybe if I move the power lines. Oh my god, stop going on my own thing. Okay, that goes there. Can I have it immediately go into another one of these? Yes, I can. And it can come out there. And then this can immediately go into another one of those and come out there. Is there still a way to power everything having done that? Yes. Wait, what did I do? Oh god, I did something wrong here. Uh oh, I did something wrong. Okay, get rid of those. Get rid of all these. Get rid of all these. Stop that. Okay, try to fix this. No, no, that's right. Okay. I messed this up. You guys, you need to go underground. You need to stop. You need to go here. You need to go underground. This this is the spaghetti factory right here. There we go. I think I fixed it. Yeah, here comes the stone. Stone comes through here. It's spaghetti. Don't worry about it. The spaghetti must grow. Exactly. The spaghetti must grow. Missing underground belts. Ah! Um, I think I need that power line, so I think we're here. Let's make some more underground bells and some more regular. I think I can also pilfer some regular, uh, yeah, some transfer belts I can just pilfer from right here. Okay. Um, why is my science? Oh, my science isn't working right here. There we go. That I'll do more sciencing. Okay. Um, I also am going to keep grabbing these so that they make more. Uh, I'll keep grabbing some of these too so they make more. And I'll keep grabbing some of these too because I just want them. Okay, cool. Um, 
Now what do we need to do? In order to make black science juice, we need grenades, piercing rounds, and walls. Wait, that's stones, not walls. I need walls. I needed that wall maker. I thought it was stone. Heck. No, dude. Okay. Just stop all this. I'll put it back. Okay, I do want the walls here. I do want the walls. And you can take from that and go there. This will still work. Yeah, this will still work. But I messed up. I'm gonna have to take all these stones. I didn't want stones. I wanted walls. <laughs> Alright. Heck. Okay, I should queue up research. Um, concrete. Faster research speed. Get that. Electric stuff, tool belts, engines, circuits. I don't know what optics we'll do later, but I probably should just get all these because they probably lead to something later. Okay, I just want to queue up a whole bunch of stuff. Okay, I think we can still fix this now. Um, yeah, you just need to put walls into there and... All right. I can load up some walls. Is that walls? I can load up some walls on the belt. Also, just to have it ready. Okay. Now I think we have everything. Uh, oops, I gotta, I gotta remove these bricks. We don't want bricks. We want walls. We don't want bricks. We don't want bricks. We don't want bricks. Why are there so many bricks still? Oh my god, why are there so many bricks still? Why are there so many bricks? Okay, there we go. Um. Okay, now we gotta decide where to actually put this stuff. Wait, what do we need exactly again for this? Walls, grenades. Okay, so we need grenades. Maybe I can just combine both of these right here. There's grenades and those. Um, and then we need these walls. Hi, Lutzi. Good morning. The steel be belt for red ammo got clogged. The steel belt. Oh, did I mess it up somewhere? Uh, there it goes. There it goes. They're still making. All right, we just don't have enough. Oh god, there's like a big attack coming in over here. Um, do we need more production of these? Go check on this. I can't get through that. Cool. Using these grenades, I can go defeat some of the nearby nerds as well. That would probably be helpful. Did you extend that belt? Did it? Did something go wrong? I didn't see anything go wrong. a triple layer wall here and let's make a triple layer wall here jeez how much just learned this game been so long <laughs> this game seems very complex for sure okay i still don't have I, i'm probably gonna bring all this stuff let's bring all this stuff over this way also while i'm sitting here let's like make some more belts um let's bring all this stuff over here i think I think that's gonna make more sense. Okay, and then we can make black science juice here, then probably just pump it directly into one of these labs. So let's make um, let's make black science juice here. Uh, do I have enough assemblers? No, I need to make more assemblers. We should just make the better assemblers soon, if not now. Um. We're gonna need to keep getting some more upgrades soon here just to keep fending everything off. I have enough walls now that I can make triple thick walls on all these, which I I feel I should do while I'm waiting. 
because I have so many walls now. That'll triple thick walls will at least take them a long time to get through. Okay, cool. Thanks, Jamadus. Thanks, Ku. The biters are getting more frequent. Yeah, I think it's time to attack as soon as I get the black science juice done. Black science juice is going to be extremely helpful here. Um, I think I have enough room to do it right here, so let's just do it here. Uh, I need some more long inserters. And then I need some more regular inserters too. What am I talking about? Okay, let's grab... We're going to grab uh, walls and we're going to grab both things from here. Hopefully I've got it right with regular inserters and long inserters. Oops, I always orient everything wrong. Gotta fix that. Turn around. And then these are going to make black science juice. I did the wrong thing. Black science juice. There we go. You guys are gonna take that and put it down here. If I could just, nah, whatever. I'm just gonna put it down here. Okay, I'll run it up there. Nice. Okay, black science juice is coming in. In case I want to make some more, I left some extra room there. Nice. And you guys can put it in. Get some power to these nerds. I mean, that's still... This is still way better than my usual. <laughs> like, even though this is still a spaghetti factory, this is a much better... This is a, this is a finely honed spaghetti factory compared to... <laughs> compared to how it normally goes with me. All right. Uh, I got 15 turrets. That's pretty good. Get a few more, but um, and then let's. We want to get engines in a car and stuff so we can drive around. But I think it's time to start. Um, I think it's time to start clearing some of these camps. How many fish do I have? Let's maybe go get some more fish over here and then clear some camps out. Um, let's do one last ammo. One last ammo deposit. Just so that while I'm gone, nothing bad happens, and then I think we're ready to. To go blow up some camps. Designs are definitely yeah. The designs are definitely getting better. They're still not great, but they're. I'm using the long inserters a lot more. That was huge. I think. Like I finally wrapped my head around having two conveyor belts next to each other, kind of doing the same stuff. It's really helpful. Oh, I may also want to increase iron production. Yeah, it looks like we kind of need a little more iron. Um, let's see. I'll take some of this regular ammo. Just to have a little bit more to restock here. But I'm switching over to the red ammo for my own character. Yeah, I need to just... Um, can, I, can I do it while I'm here? Just slap down some more... Slap down some more drills. Probably... Uh, get rid of these. And... How would I best do this? Something like this. This should be tons more iron. do it while I'm here. I think that'll work just like that. Or does it need to be split in some way or another? I guess it's all going into one anyway. Okay. That's probably gonna be too much iron and I need to like split it into a different lane or something, but whatever. It's good enough for what it's doing right now. Good enough for what it's doing right now. Okay. Um... Let's go blow some bugs up. Now let's go blow some bugs up. Hello, bugs. Um, all right, pull those nerds down here. Let's go blow this up. This is proper pasta now. Excellent. Get these nerds out of here. I'm gonna make some more of this myself, and I do want to grab some fish if I can. Yeah, here's some fish. The fish will heal us. I zoom out a little bit here because I want to see if there are any enemies coming after me. 
Uh, yeah, here you go. Here's a little base right here, and we can um, blow up the base with these grenades. There we go. Blow up this guy. Okay, there's one small base destroyed. That's good. Um, everything's okay right there, right? Jeez, where did those guys all come in from? Oh, um, what is that right there? What is that? I wonder if I should... These bases look maybe too big for me to blow up right now, but... I don't know. Let's go over here. What's happening down here? Entities are being destroyed and damaged? What? Wait, what happened? What happened here? Were they, at they were attacking this? Oh, I think they kind of came in right here. Um... Let's do this instead. All right. Um. Hey, T. Magdire. Hello. Do you know inserters can fish for you? No, I didn't. Wait, how did we lose power? I just realized we lost power everywhere. How did that happen? Um, oh, did they destroy a power line right here? They did, didn't they? Yeah, they destroyed some power lines right there. Just noticed. What a bunch of nerds. Okay, let me go snag some more ammo. Yeah, now the iron is like fully stopped up right here. Okay, I'm gonna snag some ammo off of here. Um, also gonna snag some ammo and some grenades off of here. All the logistics are going. All right, cool. I'll snag some of these. It's nice to just have some basic resources on me so that if I need to handcraft anything, it won't take too long to actually make. Um, like for instance, I could use some more belts. I could use some... Um, Inserters. Okay, I think we're pretty good. Yeah, I think we're pretty good. Okay, cool. Let's go see if we can deal with this base down here while everything is researching. Holy crap, they are really busting through right here. That's not good. Stop it. Hmm. All right. Yeah, let's do our best to blow up some bases here. Actually, if I had more ammo... If I had enough to put the armor piercing rounds in, I could blow up bases with the armor piercing rounds. Um, don't know if, if I really have enough yet. What is limiting me on that? Is it steel? Steel's limiting. Wait, what is ha what has happened here? This I just realized this got a little clogged up right here. Did I fix it? Yeah, I fixed it. Okay, that got a little clogged up right there. Um, if I could produce a little bit more steel here it would be beneficial let's see if I can make it happen I think I can make it happen um, let's see will this work I want that coal going in there um Let's see, you want to grab grab from there with the long arm, put from there with the short arm. Oh, the problem is getting power to these. Uh, no, we got power to them, right? I can't get power to that one. I can fix it with an underground. Using the underground belts to get more space is good. I want to keep trying to do that. And then we're just missing inserters loading those up okay cool that's better and I can turn these into better furnaces too if we need I can turn all these into better furnaces I'll probably start making some better furnaces to do that I'll just have to get some steel plates myself for that okay cool but I'll slowly start doing that so we can make even more steel plates that way because these guys are pretty saturated so if I made these into better furnaces it would go a little faster 
we'll slowly start replacing some better furnaces. Okay, cool. Um, let's go blow up some nerds. Let's go blow up some nerds. The inserter on the second furnace is bad. Shoot. Did his base get wiped? No, I died. The base didn't get wiped, but it felt like I was too far behind. The inserter on the second furnace is bad. Uh, oh, yeah. Right here. Um, wait. What have I done? Is there a pole right there? Uh, problems. <laughs> I don't even know if this is fixable. Because uh, the pole has to be... The pole can be right there instead. Put the pole here. And then you go... You go under here and come out there. Does that work? I think I've done it right now. No, wait, you're still not doing anything. Shit! Um, needs to be over one more. Needs to be over one more. Wait. I think I did it now. There we go. I did it now. I wasn't sure if they could put them in it like that, but I guess they can. Okay, I'm gonna take some of these myself. I think I did it right now. Make more of those. Um, make these even faster. One of them is missing the output inserter. Ah, really? This one doesn't have the output inserter. There we go. Oh, I have 98 steel plates just sitting in it. <laughs> well, that's actually kind of good because I needed those. <laughs> I got to get rid of all these copper plates, though. The copper is, like, completely stalled. Okay, let's just... Yeah, let's replace these all with better furnaces so that we have a lot of these coming in now. Cool. And then we can uh, replace some of these with better furnaces, too. Okay, cool. I'll keep doing that more later. But yeah, just replacing everything with better furnaces will improve our production a lot. Need to replace the furnace's smelting iron. Is that the most important one? It's limited by that. Um, let's go destroy maybe this base down here. That seems doable. Is it doable? <laughs> I don't know. If I can destroy this one, it'll be nice. Let's let's do a little test here. See what I'm capable of doing. Actually, shoot. I should have grabbed more ammo first. 76 is a bit low. Um, well, let's try it with 76. I do have, I do have grenades. Oh, I, boy, do I have grenades. <laughs> Look at how sick grenades are. Oh my God. Grenades are so good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're all a bunch of nerds. You know it. Yeah, you're nerds. Oh, there's also some iron right here. That's interesting. It's only a small patch, but... Oh, that's a tree. Why am I shooting the tree? Eat the fish. I need to get heavy armor. Shoot. I just... I was like, why am I taking so much damage? And then I realized that I never got heavy armor. Uh, kind of bad, actually. I should probably get heavy armor before doing this. Probably get heavy armor before... On the other hand, get fucked, nerds! Get fucked, nerds! Oh god, my things are dying. Get fucked, nerds! Get fucked, nerds! Get fucked, nerds! Okay, that should really lower the amount of times that we're getting attacked, though, now that I, uh, now that I got rid of these. Sick. 
You don't have the red ammo. Yeah, I don't, uh, I don't fully have quite enough red ammo. But anyway, I think just, just that will reduce the amount we're getting attacked. And then maybe it'd be nice to take out one of these two or that one. But wait, is that iron? That's stone. What do we have nearby? We have some, just a little bit of iron right there. Not really much. Is that it? That's all we can see. There's a bunch of, oh, there's a massive thing of coal up there. And we do have some, um, we have oil right here too. Okay. Yeah, maybe we'll take out this one next because that is, a, oh, there's oil right there too. Yeah, maybe we'll take out this one and get the oil. Um, but that was good. That's what reduced the amount we're getting attacked just already. That's good. And yeah, we need to ramp up uh, red ammo production so I can put red ammo in everything. That would be very nice too. Let's see how we're doing here. Um, I think more better furnaces um, is going to be going to be very very good for our full getting full production online. Okay, yeah, these are all actually being used. Lots of these. I don't need all these copper plates in my. Inventory. Don't need these guys anymore. Store my extra junk in here. Um, I'll make uh, I'll make some. I'll just feed this into the line here with the chest just to get it get it out of my inventory. I don't need it. I'll just put all my uh, iron ore in there. Of it. Let's see. I do need power on this though. Let's make some more power lines. Oh, am I limited on wood right now? I gotta go chop down some trees and get some wood. Okay, let's get some ammo. Uh, black science packs won't get distributed between labs since lab inserters are only pointed right. Ooh, let me go look at that. Let me go look at that. That sounds important. Also, I completely forgot that these are still just running off of coal, but whatever. <laughs> well, oh yeah, I think I was gonna try to do something about that with this coal up here, and then we got very sidetracked. Oh, look at all this red ammo though, this is great. Got lots of red ammo. Um, I need to buy more turrets. And, okay, wait, the issue is Oh. These need to face like this. There we go. There we go. Yeah, I messed that up. Um. Wait, but how do I do this? How do I do this right? Um. If these aren't gonna get green then. Ah oh, man. Um, maybe I need to just. Okay, I know what I need to do. That's what I need to do. That's what I need to do. But I should just put the black science juice over here. <laughs> This will be easier, I think. Uh, there we go. Grab black science juice. Wait, what have I done here? Grab black science juice. All right. Pretty darn sure that it's good now because everything's going into this one and this one's feeding both directions. Should be good now. Uh, green production needs to increase. Let's make some more of these. Um, I gotta get some gear wheels though. Let's grab some basic, some basic stuff here off the line. I can grab some of this. Uh, is this even being used over here? This is like not even being used right here, right? Okay. Um, let's craft some stuff myself here, just to uh, make some improvements. Okay, yeah, this is good. I'm glad this is piling up now. That's good. 
Um, need all science to work. Somebody missing inserters? Wait. <laughs> Am I missing inserters? Ah. Let's see. I want to get these faster things on green because I feel like I'm limited by green. Yeah, I'm limited by green science for some reason right now. Um, which, oh, maybe it's because I'm limited on inserters. Okay, wait, why am I limited on inserters? You guys are making inserters. Um, are you, wait, what the heck? There isn't a, what the heck? I understand. There is no, what is happening here? How did this happen? Oh my God. All right. You weren't even doing anything. Okay, now maybe we'll be okay on that. What do I need for these? More iron gear wheels. I feel like I need more gear wheels. That would just involve putting, improving these. So let's, uh, let's get more gear wheels coming in. Good, 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 good. Let me snag some of these plates. Snag some of these and make, oh, snag some of these and make better armor. Definitely should do that. This is uh, pointlessly limiting, right? What are you even doing? Why are you even there? Or was it, oh wait. Did it need, does it need to be there? No, it doesn't need to be there. That was just limiting that for no reason. Okay, good. Then these could be probably... Wait, are you even grabbing anything? This one's not even functional. Who built this factory? Wait. Why aren't you grabbing stuff? Huh? Huh? It, can it not reach? It couldn't reach. Okay, yeah, who built this factory? What the heck? This factory sucks. <laughs> this happened as you built it this way? The chat tried to point it out. Ah! Oh my gosh. Uh, thanks, airline food. <laughs> All right, we finally have everything mostly online now. Oh my God, black science juice production is good though, at least, if nothing else. Um, yeah, 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 black. Si Wait, we don't have any walls coming in. Okay, we're limited by wall production here. Why is that happening? You're making walls. Oh, because I'm still grabbing these walls. Um, but we have enough for now, so maybe it's fine. Because I still... Well, maybe I don't need that many walls. <laughs> maybe I have too many walls. Um, I don't know. Oh, God. What's happening down here? I don't like that sound. Does that mean they're destroying walls? I gotta go refuel everything. I gotta go refuel everything. What the fuck is happening here? Spitters? Wait, do we have spitters already? How do we have spitters already? Oh no. Oh, we might be dead and have to restart. This was a slow start, I felt. Um, how do we have spitters already? That's crazy. I guess I'm putting good ammo in these guys now. How do we have spitters already? I feel like this is way faster than our last game on spitters. What the fuck? What the fuck? Um, in that case, I think we cancel all of this and we immediately get um, projectile damage. Yeah, we need projectile damage and then stronger explosives or else we're cooked here. Are we doing projectile damage? Yeah, okay. That's so bad. Holy moly. Um, maybe I gotta go destroy another base here. I do have 20 turrets. That's pretty good. Got lots of walls. Um, yeah, that's so bad. Okay. Where are we the most concerned about getting wrecked by spitters? It's a pretty big army right here. I could just go intercept. Mm. Getting rid of this one would be nice. I mean, we might be dead here. 
Um, how far did you get compared to how far you are now? In my last one, I got trains in oil, and I think I was... I destroyed, like, 15 bases. I destroyed tons of bases. This one, I had a really rough start. Um, but the factory that I built after that, having the rough start, is much better. So this factory is way better. We just... We just... I think we just went slow at the beginning of this one because of the really rough start. But I'm really surprised that there's spitters already. I don't... I think there were even spitters in my last game so much further along than this. Yeah, run two technically could have kept going, but... Um, do I have enough ammo? Yeah, I have enough ammo this time. 86 grenades is not great, but it's not terrible either. I didn't build the heavy armor. Hold on. Before we do this, I need to build heavy armor. Okay. I have to make the heavy armor. Let's go get 50 steel plates. Then I can go blow those up. Why is projectile damage three not going? I don't like that. Why is it stalled? Are you able to make trains? I did make some trains, yes. It was very awesome. I'm a little confused why my research is stalled. Uh, Salty said, they have 15 months. I love seeing you play this game. You have 2,000 hours. It's amazing modding scene. The DLC is very hype. Okay, what the fuck did I do here? Green science juice died. How did green science juice die? Here's green science juice. Uh, it died because inserters died. Wait. Why aren't you making inserters? It died because electronic circuits died. I killed electronic circuits somewhere back. You're making electronic circuits out of Oh, my iron died. Why is that? Why did iron die? Wait, is that the problem? Is the problem that iron died? Yeah, copper cables. We have plenty of copper cables. Iron died. Why did iron die? Iron's not getting through here because we're taking it more of it here. Maybe? Is it just too slow through here? Is that the problem? It's just too slow through here? Um, I don't... Yeah, these extra furnaces... It's because these extra furnaces. That's why. We're taking even more now because of these extra furnaces. Um, iron isn't piled up though, so let's... Like, maybe this is solvable with these? Oops, I'm stupid. Put it one further down. Uh, let's at least see what this does. Okay, let's look at what that did. See if that if we just get clogged here or I could put in faster belts if we just get clogged right there I need a whole bunch of iron gear wheels. It's still not getting down there Let's see if it just gets clogged right here. Maybe this needs to branch around and then like Connect up right there. That's actually super easy to do uh, If I split this If I split this I can just wrap it around and specifically go to those other ones that are not getting fed. Um, can I though? Yes, because these can be underground. Like this, and then this can be underground. Or does it need to wrap around on itself? I don't. I still don't fully understand if I have to do this or not. Um, and then this one can just. This one also needs to like do that. Oh no 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 no! It doesn't need to do that. It doesn't need to do that. This can just go to it. I think that'll work as is. There we go. 
Yeah, there we go. All right, iron is back. Whoo! Um. Okay, I need to skim off a ton of this and make heavy armor. And then I need to go blow up some. I need to get a bunch of good ammo and a bunch of grenades. I need to just go blow up some nerds. Delicious spaghetti. Uh, all the iron ore is condensed into one side. Yeah, I thought that was the. I thought that was the problem. You know, you can check how miners are doing. Yeah, I know. Um, this is still like backed up a bit right here. Let's um make let's get a couple of these guys chugging even faster chug 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 on that iron all right cool but now we have a lot more iron coming in so that should be good and um, everything else should start up again here soon I think yeah you guys have tons of iron now oh we're limited by these circuits aren't we so we should make a faster circuit producer right there. Yeah. Make both of these faster for faster green science juice. Probably need to have two of these. Um, see, I didn't leave room for that shit. <laughs> I can make, actually maybe it's fine. I can put these underground somewhere. Hmm. Yeah, maybe need to revisit. I, I think in the future I need I need I just need to I just need to know that I need multiples of these. Like I just let myself room for one, and that was a another mistake in the design again, where I keep not leaving enough room. It's hard to know what I need more of and what I don't, and also what I can do without dying. Because it's like obviously if I could just have infinite room, it'd be great, but I can't have infinite room because I'm gonna get wrecked by the bugs. Inserters are too slow. Um, I don't see that being an issue. Uh, or maybe right here it's an issue. Yeah, maybe a faster inserter would help right here. But the problem is, is that it's a, it's a problem in some places and not in others, and it's hard to identify those things when I'm a noob still. Okay. But yeah, that's way faster. Now the green is backing up a bit more. So we should get more inserters. Inserters are still like basically at their limit right here though. So I do need quite some, quite a lot of inserters. Yeah, I, I just need a second one of these things. Even with all the faster ones, they're still basically just using it up. But let's see how green, green science production is at least more now. Okay, it's backed up. No, but it's still not down here, though. Let's see. The, these four come in. The green science... Let's let's see if it... Okay, we, it looks like we need a little more green science. Looks like we need a little more green science. So, let's see what we can do here. Um, take some of these conveyors. These are getting used a lot more. I think I need four of these and two of these, but at least more of this right now. This would actually go faster if there were more copper cables just going into even just this one. Um, I'm a little worried about the base. Let me reload better ammo now that there's spitters. Yeah, that physical projectile damage takes a long time to finish. Do I have my heavy armor? Did I make heavy armor? Yes. Okay, heavy armor is going to help a lot for destroying bases. You guys still have lots of ammo. Alright, uh, I think I'm going to go try to destroy that lower base. It will... Oh god, another one of these died. Yeah, I need to go destroy this lower base or we're going to be... Sad pandas. We grab some fish. hope to one day grab fish did you get flame turrets no I didn't uh, we got f uh, we got oh I actually I did but I didn't know I didn't know how to set them up I wasn't sure if I had to pump the oil directly into the turret I was experimenting with like the um, 
the various different forms of like getting in petroleum gas and doing all sorts of stuff. What is up with this? I gotta learn how evolution works. If anybody has info on evolution, I'd like to know. Because, um, they, the bugs evolve spitters much faster. Is there some randomness to it? In my last game, I, am I wrong? I don't even remember them having spitters and I played way longer than this. At least I think I played way longer than this. Maybe this, just, maybe this one just took forever and I didn't realize it. I don't know. Uh, okay, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna drop like an ass load of turrets all over everything in here. Just like clear these out. There we go though, that's how we take out the bases. That's how we take out the bases. Okay, well I'm still at a level where I can take out the bases pretty well. Less trees this one. Uh, evolution goes up by time, pollution, and death. Ooh, interesting. Okay, so maybe the pollution is the problem this time. But here's the thing. The enemies themselves aren't nearly as strong this round. Like, I could still I can still bust through those guys fine, right? Like, it wasn't hard for me to take out that base. Um, so, they, I think they got spitters sooner, but the enemies themselves aren't uh, as dangerous still. So, it's almost like there's two separate evolutionary trees. There's also in-game information without using the console if you're interested. Trees make the start of the game so much easier. You have a lot of trees. Oh, you have a lot less trees around your base. I see. That's why it was so tough for me. Let's take out this whole base. You only have medium. Lattice type got the big biters. Yeah. I just don't remember spitters last time. Could be wrong about that. But I'm, I'm at the point right now where I can just destroy these bases in two seconds. So that's good. That's the that's the point where I want to stay at. And I may as well get that iron at some point. It's not a ton, but it's something. Pull a bunch of the nerds out. Pull a bunch of the nerds out, and then I gotta heal up, and then I'll drop a ton of. Uh, it's a little bit harder to see here with the darkness. God. Okay. Uh, let me heal up. I'm waiting for a break, but there's like not gonna be a break, I don't think. So, let me just heal up, and then we'll drop the turrets. Yeah, if I, do, if I drop the turrets fast enough, it goes really well. I'm a little worried about my base. Oh my god, please survive that. I gotta go destroy that northern one. I gotta go destroy that northern base, and then I think we're gonna be set for a while. We can go make some trains, then it's gonna be sick. Evolution is all created, but only absorbed by nests lead to new biters. Well, that's so weird that they like absorb the pollution According to the wiki Let me read this real quick so I can learn uh, According to the wiki it's all pollution created Hmm Pollution is bugs food Interesting yeah, so by lack of trees, I'm just going to produce or get a lot more. Okay. Yeah, maybe let's go destroy that one, and then I'll be pretty happy for now. Then I think we're not going to... Then I think we're going to have time to do stuff. 
I'm realizing that I need to just have like 30 turrets on me at all times and then I can pretty much just overwhelm a base with turrets. Works out really well. Let's get some fish. Lots of fish right here. Definitely got way more efficient at taking out those bases now that I understand like when to throw all the turrets and just dump ammo in them. And when, especially like right when you get piercing rounds, they are really devastating too. Okay, now we have enough fish for a long time. You cleared a large area so you weren't seeing the bugs as they evolved. Yeah, I think I just wasn't um, getting my base attacked and so the fact that they had spitters or not just wasn't as big of an issue. Okay, I like how this is bunched up now. That's a really good sign that we did what we needed to do. Yeah, look, now everything's bunched up. All right, good, 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 good. And green science juice is bunched up. Okay, now the labs are finally at full capacity. So we did fix those problems, thankfully. And let's keep snagging some grenades and some of this red ammo. Good. Fixed a lot of those problems. We'll have, a, we'll have our upgrades coming. This is good. I think we're in a fantastic position right now. Uh, it lo also looks like the steel is like... Like we, or the iron, I mean, is like all being produced too. Like, we're, this is good. This is good levels of production. We're getting everything we want. Um, to that end, I do want to keep making a bunch of turrets. Make, for those pushes, it's actually so nice to just have like 30 of them. Um, so I need even more. I do need to steal more of these plates though. Why were those so full of plates? Oh, the inserters can't place them as fast as these produce them? Is that true? Oh, probably just because it got bunched up. I think just because it got bunched up. Yeah, just because it got bunched up. Okay, cool. So I don't need faster inserters there. Um, these guys still aren't getting... It's, it's actually crazy. These guys still aren't getting anything. Yeah, these guys are dormant. Interesting wild how, how fast these guys are just pulling everything off that line hmm. and then yeah this is yeah this is this one's kind of bunched up how do I fix that this is a weird problem to fix half of this one is kind of bunched up don't know how to fix that well I could just have another thing come off of it and come up here but that's kind of jank Feels kind of jank. But if it works, it works, right? <laughs> oh my god. If it works, it works. Wait, I'm, these are facing the wrong way. Yeah, there we go. All right, dejanked. Is it really dejanked though? Is it really de? Wait, that's still bunched up right there. <laughs> Why? Stop it. Maybe that's better. How is this still bunched up? When you fix something that isn't the actual bottleneck. Well, it's hard to tell what the actual bottleneck is when you've been playing the game for three days. All right, anyway. Um, More turrets, and then I think we'll be good on that. Okay, how are we doing on power? Not good. Let's build some more power while we're here. Um, I still have another steam engine and a boiler, so let's just add these. Small electric poles in the way. Get it out of here. 
Oh, uh, let's make some more boilers. Wait, no, I want more steam engines, don't I? No more boilers. Heck. Uh, wait, yeah, I need a, I need a pipe. Let's always do this wrong. I think I recall that we need a bunch of pipe too. I gotta get some iron plates just in my inventory. At some point. I'm gonna go grab some stuff. You don't like the bugs? Yeah, I, that makes sense. Oh, hey, iron plate. You know, maybe I should keep these going. Um, oh, is there no more coal any, or is there no more stuff? They've already mined everything. I see. They've already mined everything. Okay. Any of these have any stockpile? Why are you go Oh, you guys are stockpiled now here. I see. You're stockpiled now here with a lot of iron plates because we've max production of that. Okay, cool. That's good. That's good. Um, so I can make a lot of stuff. What do I need? I could use some more inserters. Okay. Um, at some point I'm going to have to come up with hotkeys that I can keep going back to and using. There's a bunch of crab in my inventory I should dump, by the way, at some point. Probably be useful. Um, okay, I need those pipes. Let's get the pipes. And the boilers. Oh god. Okay, yeah. There's the pipes. And steam engines and boilers. Uh, probably move that down. Let's just move this down here. Hmm. Thanks, Expo. We are learning steam engines. I need a whole bunch of them. Oh, no, like I have the, the added ammo, the better ammo. Make it work for okay, they're probably gonna need the most ammo until we go take care of that base anyway. Um, wait, you need power from this. Okay. Right. Right. Let me get a bunch of steam engines. Get another boiler down here. More steam engines. Okay. I am going to also try to put radars up all over the map because I don't think I appreciated how useful radars are. So whenever I go, next time I go kill a base or something, I'm just gonna like bring a radar or something. Just maybe just put a radar right here. Just like that would be really useful. The second engine is not connected to power. Oh yeah, don't worry. I'm waiting for the other two to come over here. Then I was gonna do it. Okay, now we're doing better on power, but honestly, let's just keep making more of these while we're here. Feels like we should just have more for later. We're going to run out again. Um, I need a pipe, please. Oh, I'm making the steam engines. That's right. Yeah, I need to. I need, also need to remember to just like if I just go and grab some gear wheels, it won't take so long to craft this stuff. I gotta remember to do that. Um, there we go. Character's always in the way with these. All right, good. Two inserters. Some power, some power. 
gonna put this one here for symmetry. Oh yeah, beautiful symmetry until it gets asymmetric again. Don't look at that. Um, cool. There we go. Power. Have you gotten further than run two? No, run two was further than this. We got trains in run two, but not that much further than this. Okay, I think I want stronger explosives. Actually, I feel like leaning just more into the turrets and then just dropping turrets to blow up bases is really, really useful. So I might go straight for physical damage four here. But what am I missing for trains? I guess I don't want trains yet. I want the damage first, blow up the bases, and then when we have a then we have a reprieve, then we can get the trains. We're missing engine. Actually, yeah, engine's gonna be super important soon here. Let me just get engine next. Uh, let's get engine next. Okay, cool. Good, good, good. I think we're just about ready to go blow up some more bases. What are you doing? Uh, this will be my junk drop-off box, so let's keep dropping off junk over here. I don't need... I'll put the science juice in the thing. I don't need this. I don't need this. I don't need this. I don't need that. Um... I don't need this. Don't need that. I don't think I need stone bricks for anything. But I'm gonna keep one stack just because I don't don't actually know for sure. There we go. Much cleaner inventory. That should help a bit. Oh, medium electric pole. I've gotta try that. I don't quite understand what the medium electric poles do, but just looking at it, it says the wire reaches longer and the supply area is better. So, I don't know. <laughs> There's that. Um, I will also, I want a couple stacks of steel plates. Um, yeah, a couple stacks of iron plates would be good. I want some steel plates as well. A bit of steel plates. Yeah, just to carry with me at all times when I need to craft stuff. And then I also want some of these guys to carry with me to craft stuff. And some of these guys to carry with me to craft stuff. Some of these guys are good. Oh yeah. Oh, these guys are like super backed up. Mm, num, 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 num. Very good. And I'm just gonna drop off my science juice. Okay, cool. I have a lot of good resources. Everything's looking pretty good. I think I maybe want to make some more labs. Research faster. Let's drop some more labs down while we're here. That'll help us out a lot. Um, is that correct? Who knows? Let's try a medium electric pole. I've never used one. Big electric pole. Though the wire goes really far, but it doesn't supply a lot. So that's really good for just, I see, just going really far. Okay, let's try this medium electric pole. I mean, it's a bit bigger or whatever. Kind of gets everything in one. Okay, whatever. <laughs> um, I think I might need some better inserters here. Yo, uh, Stephen Lee, thank you so much for the raid. I really appreciate it. Wait, I've literally got that guy facing the wrong direction. Me big dumb. Um... learning more about the game what's going on up here engine is finished let's get the stronger physical damage it's gonna be so good yeah we need to we need to go blow up those bases so that these guys are not working so hard these guys are working really hard right now Oh yeah, um, soon we want to also make engines. Yeah, we just got the stuff to make engines, cool. Uh, probably the rest of the line is also an intended new lab. Wait, did I, 
Mess something up. I am addicted to Factorio, it's true. Should turn around. What is this? Everything's working, right? I think everything's working. Alright, let's go take out a base. That will give us more space. So that we're not constantly getting attacked up here. I actually think I do need... Oh, I don't even need wood anymore if I use the medium electric poles. That's cool. So maybe I don't need too much wood anymore. Just get a little bit just to have it, but then... It's not good! Oh, oh no, is one of them facing the wrong way? I have a really bad problem with seeing the way that the inserters are facing. Oh. Everything is fine now. It works out one way or another, right? <laughs> works out one way or another. Wait, how does the black science juice even get over here? Hold on a second. <laughs> oh my god. Everything's fine. So fine. Okay, yeah, it's got to be way more efficient. Oh, we're still limited by green science juice. Is that because I pulled a bunch of stuff off the line myself? It's limited by these guys. We're just going to be limited by those guys until I make more... Let's... All oh, right, fine. We'll do it. Let's make two more of these. Should have done this probably a while ago. Um, make two more of these. And then run those into the other one. Okay, there we go. That should make us a lot more inserters. Oh wait, no, we need more green. Well, right now we're good on green, but we're gonna need more green boys, I think. Uh, let's see how it. Let's see how it ends up. Wait, this is in the wrong side. No. No. They're in the wrong side. Ah. Okay. Um. the easiest way to make something go to the top like that what if I okay cosmic brain cosmic brain is it cosmic you know it's not this will put it at the right place though right <laughs> yo there we go all right go my long arm friend get him I don't know if that guy's gonna be fast enough. If not, I can put a second one right here if I need to. But I also wouldn't mind having some extras of those for once in my life. Okay, did it. Nice solution, let's go. I would like a whole bunch of red ammo, thank you. All right, let's blow up some bases, blow up some bases. We should be able to do this. I'm pretty sure I could take out both of these bases and then we're just gonna have free reign of just making trains and living the good life. Maybe we can go get some oil or something. Why long arm? I didn't know how else to make it go to the top path. I mean, I guess I could have made it come past and then come right back down. I don't know. I'm not good at this game. Oh, get wrecked nerds. Oh my god, I get absolutely fucked. I, every time I go out, it's night. Does it just... <laughs> why do I never wait until day to go kill these nerds? I always forget how annoying it is at night to actually fucking see what's happening. Um, one nice thing is I can put some turrets down on the low ground right here and then I, and then I can't even really hardly get to them. This is a massive base, so this is going to be interesting. Okay, we're just going to try to clear out some of the nerds here. Clear out some of the nerds, and then we'll drop a ton of... We'll drop a ton of turrets when the time is right. We just have to wait for the time to be right. Time is Holy shit! Uh, grenade! 
grenades. <laughs> Man, the grenades are so good. Okay. Time is almost right. Time is almost right. Heal up. Kill these nerds. Oh, there we go. That's how we do it. That is how you do it. You got to just like, you don't make one wave of turrets. You make one wave of turrets. That's a distraction. And then you make like 20 more waves of turrets. That's how you fucking do it. Really like this new strategy. It's working great. Oh, I got to repair these. Shoot. What is this? Big sandy rock. <laughs> what? <laughs> This is fun. I really like how we're developing this strategy. It's very effective. Gotta repair the rock. Yeah, I was like, what am I repairing right now? I think I only lost like, what, like one turret or something? Let's heal you up too. Gotta make sure these are all ready to go. And so instead of having to waste ammo, like, 30 times from this nest every time the nest attack. Holy shit, that is massive. Might need to be going back down there. Uh, might need to be going back down there. <laughs> Zoom in more, does it work? Yo. These guys, oh, we did lose a turret, but okay. Hopefully they can't imagine, was that these guys? I'm gonna have to go destroy these next, but let's finish, let's do this one. Let's do this one. Jeez, that was massive looking. <laughs> we got the new ammo just in time. All right, so grenades are the best at clearing out the little waves here. Fuckers. God, that deals so much damage, holy shit. All right, so the grenades clear out these waves. I have 55. That's pretty good. Then we push with the turrets here. When the time is right. When the time is right, so then you'll up. Oh, I'm like stuck in goop. Good push, good push. Um, I need to go. F There's like another base down there though that I need to go get. Yeah, getting kind of low on grenades too. Low on ammo on those turrets over there, which is slightly concerning me, but hopefully they can hold off for a second here. It's not the end of the world if I lose a few turrets. At this point, there are hardly any resources. The ammo is like more resources, I feel like, than the turrets. <laughs> I do got to make sure they're repaired, I think, or else I'm going to be dropping half dead turrets. Yeah, we got to clear this little bit right here. I've only lost two turrets. That's incredible. Nerd. I'm shooting myself with my own grenade. Small problem. Annoying. Wait, do I not have my? Oh, I'm out of grenades. Um, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Just worry about it a little bit. All right, cool. Whew. Uh, walk while repairing. Locks you in place until done for convenience. Yeah, I can't move while I'm repairing, right? I don't think I can move while I'm repairing. 
I do know that the bugs evolve faster, but I also feel like I need to... I'm standing in death. I also feel like I need to clear the ones that are, like, always attacking me, because it will... It will be good in the end. Or do they actually evolve faster? I don't know. Wasn't someone saying that it only is pollution? But yeah, it is a massive net W to clean out a couple ones that are like, like this one would attack me 20 times in the next three hours or none at all <laughs> if I just kill it. Um, so I think it's essential to kill some of the early ones so you can just have some breathing room. Um, I think I was like kind of got to the point where I was good for knowing how the evolution worked. Oh, yeah, the <laughs> time is a giant lie. That command hasn't been updated in like seven years. Okay. Um, research is quite slow. I think this is just a really slow one. Console info. No, no spoilers. But we shouldn't get attacked hardly at all over there anymore. For quite a while here, I think. Oh, I meant to put a radar out there. Okay, you're out. You're out. You're out. You're out. Um. Oh, does that not quite fit right there? Get a new one right there, though. And uh, may as well get these. go. Um, let's build some more of those. Let's go siphon some plates and stuff. Oh no, I have tons of plates. What do I need? I need gears. Let's go siphon some gears. I probably have a full thing of gears now. Yeah, there we go. Good for the siphoning. <laughs> Excellent. And let's go siphon some of these too. Yeah, there we go. Um, good. Good to have some basic supplies. All right, uh, reach, refill our grenades. Go on science juice for a while, it's fine. We are a little limited. I mean, because I'm probably because I'm siphoning. Oh, we, start, we still are a little limited on green science juice. Is that just production of, no, it's not production of inserters. It would be, these themselves are slow. Okay, so. Wouldn't be a bad idea then to make. There we go. That'll help us science faster. Red is fine. Black could also be faster. Is that an issue of supply of grenades potentially? Um, what's the grenade? Grenades are limited by production speed as well. So let's. Increase production speed of grenades. That'll help that out. Okay. Yeah, I think I did it right. Um, never, never automated this, but we didn't automate hardly anything last time, so whatever. <laughs> it's better. We did better this time. Could probably feed the coal into it somehow. How would I feed the coal into it? See, I could just bring it into this line and then that would be good enough. How would I... Can I split it both ways somehow? I'm gonna do a little test here. This is just me experimenting. What does a splitter do right here? Wait, I don't think I did what I wanted to do. What does this do? 
Oh, I probably need to go fix problems over here. Hold on, I'll come back to that in a second. This might be an issue over here. Uh, yeah, everything's dead. It's a bit of an issue. <laughs> yeah, it's a bit of an issue. Jesus, fuck. All right. Um, my goodness, those backups are there. Music reminds me of Minecraft music sometimes. Um. Which is a very good thing. Okay, no more of that. Yeah. Okay, I need to... F wait, what was I trying to do? I was trying to figure out if I... I did not do it right. <laughs> I did not do it right. Alright, uh, let's try again. Wait, 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 stop that. Let's try again. Um... What did I want to have happen again? I wanted to mix it in with the coal. Oh, you guys, you're out. You're still making stone. Um. Doesn't do what I wanted it to do. I wanted it to only go into half of it, but that does, I see how, I see the problem. It doesn't make it go into half when you do it like that. And this... This doesn't work, right? What does it do? It does nothing. Is there some way to split this so that this only goes in the top? Wait, no, I'm stupid. Just do it like... Wait, wait, I got it. I got it. Do I have it? If it were... Yeah, 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 yeah. I have it. There we go. And this is where I split it. Brain. But I mean, kind of in the way of my shit. <laughs> kind of in the way of my shit. But other than that, this is... There we go. That's what I wanted to have have it. Something like that. But... I, it's also everything's in the way and bad. <laughs> Wait, I don't even want it on that side because I don't have enough. Ah, fuck my life. <laughs> I do not have it. Um, I guess I want them to be coming the other direction. Like this thing, but coming from the other way would have worked better because now the stone will be in the wrong place. Is the downside. Now the stone will be in the wrong place. Fuck. I know I, I'm gonna make the miner. Well, yeah, I, I was trying to figure out where to, to do it this before I place the miners. Um, let's just do it back here. Let's just do it back here. Let's get the miners. Get this. Get the coal. Wait, get the coal from the bottom. Not like this. Because then I can place more miners later. Get this fucking rock out of the way. Has to be a better way to do this. The whole splitting of them in two different directions is like breaking my fucking brain. Does that do it? Oh, there we go. There we go. Wait, wait, wait. That's what I want. That's what I want. Okay. And now I can make another row of miners here. 
maybe that was better? No cap. Wait. Is it good or did I fuck it up? Uh, legs, I give it the 109 months. Ah! 109, and now I'm watching you mine. <laughs> oh. Thank you. All right. Something got fucked up a little bit right here, but I think that's just bunched up from old things. It's actually working, right? Please tell me it's actually working. Oh God, is it not working? I can't even tell if it's working or not. I think it, why does it keep? Oh no. Oh, the bottom miners. I see. I was like, who's causing that problem? And why is it only on this one? You're causing that problem. All right. Everything is fine. And I can... Um, also, by the way, notice how quiet it is right now? That's because I fucking killed those bases. All right. May as well just pick another one of these while we're here. Cannot reach. Okay. Whew. There we go. Now we're gonna have way too many stones. I don't any, I'm not even using that many stones. <laughs> but maybe in case I ever do, I'll do this. Oh yeah, get him. It's 200 walls. I have too many walls. <laughs> All right. Skim some of those. Cool. All right. This is all great until we run out of we run out of iron then we're gonna be sad but until then the factory must grow oh I have like ass loads of coal um, just make a little coal box right here Welp, I hate that that doesn't fit. There we go. Much better. Alright, at some point we might need more coal, but I don't think we do right now. I think we got plenty still. Okay, what do I not need in my inventory? Probably not all of these walls. I think that's plenty. I don't need this crap in my inventory. I don't need that many of those. I do you want more gears though? Don't ever want you ever again. Get out of my sight. You're broken. Get out of here. Okay. I'm gonna need to make more of these. 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 Um, let's go siphon these off. Thank you. Okay, we need red ammo and grenades. <laughs> we need red ammo and grenades. We still got, wait a minute, we're still piled up on. Why are we slow making grenades? Wait, did I mess something up? Coal, oh, we're, co we're limited on coal because of what I did. We're limited on coal, but this should have piled up with coal, or it's piling up with coal. Maybe we do need more coal. This is almost a main bus setup. <laughs> what is a main bus setup? Sounds like some fancy stuff. Um, we actually do need more coal, I think. So let's go ahead and um, let's go ahead and do that. Oh, projectile damage four finish. That's super big. And then stronger explosives is also going to be huge. But wait, before I get stronger explosives, I should get faster lab research. It just makes everything go faster, right? So this miner is like he's actually dead. <laughs> miner doesn't actually exist as a ghost. All right. I don't know if we're going to need the coal, but let's get it. Probably need it at some point.
Is it a problem that this is all on the left side there? I'm gonna try to look and see if it looks like a problem. It's all going on the left side there because of that. Is that going to cause a problem downstream? Or does it get fixed by this? Let's see what happens. I don't know how the splitters work if they like if the splitters divide stuff evenly between the sides. No, it all stays on that side, doesn't it? Let's see what happens. Hmm. It fixes the problem here, maybe. What'd you say? Look at mine. Splitters divide evenly. Okay, so we're good. It looks like everything's working well enough. Yeah, everything looks like it's working reasonably well. I keep siphoning these because I keep needing them to craft with. Green. Oh, green science juice is totally backed up now. That's so nice to see. Let's get inserters and belts. We can just siphon some. Um, black science juice could use some more production. What's the main limiter here? These just need to be uh, fancier assemblers, I think. Is that true? I think that's true. They're just waiting to produce. Um, oh, walls look like they could be a problem. Wait, wait. Walls are a problem, aren't they? We're miss three walls. I don't see backed up walls. Are walls supposed to be coming through here, I think? Um, through here? These walls, are, these walls are still a problem. Okay, this needs to be... That needs to be that. And I should probably just... I don't need any more walls, so let's... Um, Find some way to get these walls into there using s as much spaghetti as possible, if possible. And we're in. <laughs> Hacker voice, I'm in. All right, now we have, now we have plenty more walls. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I love the spaghetti. Like, I don't ever want to learn. I, I feel like when I play this game, I don't ever want to learn, like, you know, the right way to do everything. Like, I want to just, I want to just tangle everything up and do it myself because it's really fun. <laughs> it's really fun to just, oh, make some horrible spaghetti. All right, all these are, like, tapped out. Wait, why is Lab Research Speed 3 not actually researching, though? Because it needs blue and I'm an idiot, that's why. Never mind, let's get stronger explosives. There they go. Now they're cooking. <laughs> Love to see you design a circuit board. I don't know about that. Okay. Oh, I can already see the extra grenade production coming in. Good, good, good. And how are those how are the walls looking? Oh look at that. The walls are actually piling up now. Perfect. Perfect. I almost might need more assemblers for black science juice, but it's currently piled up. Let's see if it stays that way, if it was just because of that one little thing. All right, this is good. And notice again how we haven't gone attacked in like forever now, and that's because we went and destroyed those bases. That's what we needed to do earlier. It's so important, I think. Even if it makes them evolve faster, I can actually make my base so much better. This coal line is like backed up. Is that problematic? I don't know, there's tons of coal everywhere. I think it's fine. Yeah, I see like a full line of coal everywhere. It looks fine. Cool. Science juice. Killing bases helps with evolution. But it like Yeah, but it also lets me build my base and do things. I don't know how the balance works out there, but it feels like it's really useful for me. Alright, take some of these. Cool. Um, I think next we want to make an engine assembler, and we want to get want to get some enginey goodness going. I don't know if I want to automate this or if I want to just shove stuff in these. I think for now I'm just gonna shove stuff in them because I don't think I need that many engines yet, so I'm not gonna automate it yet. Um, so what do we need to put in here? We need to put in pipes, iron gears, and steel thingy things, so I can do that. Um, do that they're like I should have used the half button and then um, 
Do I want to automate pipes? Maybe soon, but not yet on pipes. What are pipes made out of? Just iron plates? It's super easy to automate. Um, here's what I'll do. I will go steal more steel plates. Num 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 uh pipes that's right let's just get these cooking and then we'll work on some other options if i control right click that's how you do it control right click okay Actually producing less coal than before. <laughs> oh no, what have I done with my coal? Uh, my poor, poor coal. Okay, we're gonna make a bunch of engine modules now. Tons of engine modules. Yeah. Um, but I think I will make an auto assembler for pipes. Cause it's just steel plates, so it's really easy to make. And let's put a limiter on it so I actually do something right with my life for once. Make tons of pipes and put a limiter on it though, so it's not too many. Just give me two stacks of pipes. It's enough pipes. All right. <sighs> Check coal production. Hey, wait, what happened here? How did those mix? I don't like to see that. Yeah, I see that it's like all on one side. Is that a problem? It all gets converted to one side right here, so it doesn't seem like it matters. A miner is wrong production chart and I forget how to use it oh, we got lots of iron coming in P whoa oh this is cool so we have the most iron being made followed by iron plates quite a bit of coal and stone not a ton of copper I and mean, we're making like grenades and science juice and Oh, you can actually specifically look at things. We're making water and steam for under fluids. We're not making any buildings. The electric mining drills are by far the most highest source of pollution. Though the boilers are pretty polluting too. Kills. Nice. Stronger explosives are done. Trains! Yes, trains. And... I'm also gonna need, okay, I need railway for more trains. And I should try the Defender. I never tried this before. So I think I'll try this one this time. What else do I need to build? Fluid handling, that sounds good too. Let's get fluid handling. And I'm gonna get this stuff just cause it's like really basic. And I feel like it might lead to some other stuff that I don't even realize it's gonna lead to. So I should just get it. Okay. Change the time frame. Oh shit. Oh shit. This is like in the last hour. Wait, that's sick. Look at that massive increase in coal production and then decrease and then leveling out of coal production. <laughs> um, research defender in the troll guide. Okay, we're finally getting attacked again, by the way. So maybe the next base for us to clear out will be these guys over here. Um, what should we do? So let's say we get trains. We have copper ore here. We have uranium here. Ooh, I think we go get that iron. 4.2 million iron right there. And then we should try uranium and maybe we should get oil. I can just go get this oil right here. Do I really want oil for anything? Maybe making flame turrets would be fun. Maybe we should try to pipe this oil back to our base. That could be fun. Now I wonder if I should destroy both of these or potentially all five of these, but that might be begging for them to evolve I don't know it's, it's unclear but if I want to get to this iron I feel like I need to take out these guys and then or maybe not though maybe I don't even need to and we can run in a train like we could I 
kind of want to go like put a radar. I'm going to go like run and put some radar up here maybe. Sounds cool. Game is very cool. Lots of good stuff to do. The research is going so fast now. I definitely need to build a bunch more turrets. Um, before I build turrets, let me just go steal some cogs. It'll go way faster if I just steal some. I'll steal some iron too. And I'll accidentally steal a bunch of coal. Heck, I need these guys. Always need these guys just to help myself. Okay. Yeah, we're kind of actually needing more iron production. Um, and this is backed up, so that can be solved actually with these. So let's make these. Uh, and then I think that that will increase our iron production a bit here. Or are they unable to... Wait, what is this guy doing? Waiting for space in destination. Fascinating. How do I solve that problem? Somehow a splitter feels like it should work for this. Mm. How do I get it to go to the top? didn't work um, I don't know how to do this I don't know how to do this I just wanted to go to the top of that same line I mean I could just have a nerd do it for me let's just get a, fa a blue nerd to do it for me Bluner does that, I think. There we go. Blue Nerd fixes it. Yeah, go Blue Nerd. But are you fast enough to do that? Um, not sure you're fast enough to do that. I need like two Blue Nerds. Two Blue Nerds. Three Blue Nerds. Hey, now we're fast enough. Oh, this guy... No, you're still good. Everybody's still good, right? Oh, you guys are still bottlenecking right there. You're not even doing anything because it's so bottlenecked. That's crazy. It's overcooked. Let's go, King. Let's go, King. Oh, my God. Honest Tortilla. Um, thank you so much for the three months. They say, hi Carl, I'm so happy you're playing this game. I need to catch my last stream, but I'm having so much fun watching you. Oh, I'm really glad you're enjoying this. I am too. Um, one of your coal miners mining iron. Oh my god. I don't s oh, there it is. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh no. Oh no. Who's the doing it? You're doing it. Get out of here. Oh my god, look at this. This nonsense. Belt poisoning. I just have to plug in my, uh, unplug my audio thing and plug it back in and it fixes itself. Belt poisoning. Look at this poisoned belt over here. What a nerd. Okay, this bottom path is still like super <laughs> super bottlenecked. Uh, I didn't need three of these guys. But I do need two of them. I mean, do I have to do the same thing again? It's weird. It's like a weird problem to have. like a weird problem to have. Do priority output on the splitter. Hmm. 
Might need my third nerd back again. Okay, yeah, that fixes it. Hmm. Um, let me go ammo up over here. How's everybody doing on ammo? Oh, you're doing great. I'd like to be able to get through here. Thank you very much. You are not doing great at all. You're dying horribly. <laughs> you're dying horribly. Okay, let's get some more ammo and then maybe go take out those other bases. And I need to construct quite a bit more turrets. do that I'm going to need to steal some of that steal some of this steal some of this steal some of this probably should steal a little bit of this landfill finish oh, wow I actually finished researching okay automated rails circuit networks gates tool belts oil automobiles yeah uh, weapon shooting speed just get I'm, I'm researching so fast right now. I just get all this stuff We'll have it all finished before I even remember about it again. We do need lots of red ammo though um, uh, I need lots of red ammo So I need to steal a little bit more that's pretty good actually Okay, what am I missing on these? Oh, the iron gears, so many gears. So many gears. This is still like stuck on the bottom here. Why is this so stuck on the bottom even still? That's wild. Still gets stuck on the bottom and then this guy doesn't have anything to do. Is it because it's just not getting used on the bottom for some reason? Is that not the issue? Oh, it's just because... Is it just because these guys are so slow? But I have enough inserters anyway. Yeah, I just backed up. Like, that's actually fine. That means we're just... That means we're using as much of it as we need. Like, that's good. That's a good problem. Okay. Are you guys at all limited by the inserter? Because I wouldn't mind more of these. I think those were being limited by the inserter, so now I should be making more of these. Certainly looks like it. Yeah, that's really nice. Very, very nice. Okay, 32 turrets, that's pretty good. I'll just help myself to some of this. All right, let's go blow up some nerds and then make some trains, I think. All quiet right here. Hi, Lankel. Good morning. It's going really well. I feel like our base is really good for once. How are we doing on power? Um, I want to go build some radars, so maybe I will... Why does the production vary? Oh. <laughs> Belt poisoning. I see. I can't get around this, can I? Oh, I can right there. That was the problem right there. That got all messed up. It's never looking better the second. I was not here for the second. What is getting attacked up there? Did I like leave some turrets up there or something? I left three turrets up there. Oops, that was a mistake. Okay, you guys. Oh my God, look at this pile of bugs right there. You guys be safe till I get back. I want to go place some radars. Um, so let's make a radar or two. I probably should have gotten the car, but this will be okay on foot too. Maybe it's a mistake, but I think I'm going to go blow these up. Because I really want to get a train up here to that iron. That is my goal for this stream, is to get a train to that iron. And also to get this oil and then pump the oil into the base. And then make like flame turrets or something with it. The goal is the rocket. 
I want trains. Goal is the trains. <laughs> Let's zoom out and see how this base looks. All right. Here's the new strata. Oh, there's like a huge army over there. That's okay though. We have... Is it okay? Is it okay? okay. I would have just attacked our base anyway. Alright, here's our new strategy for this. I feel like it's a good strategy. I do need to get rid of some of them, but not too many more. Yeah, I think this is good. Uh, get rid of these nerds here. And then... Oh god. Uh, problem, 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 problem. That was not good. That was not the time to attack. That wasn't good. There were too many of them. We messed it up. There were too many of them. There's still so many of them. Holy shit. Okay, I need to set up some back turrets. I thought I didn't have to do this, but I need to do this apparently. Okay, setting up the back turrets will really help. I should have just been doing that, I think. The back turrets will clear. And then when I have room, then I push in with the main arms. This is just a huge base, I think. Alright. Fucking what? No, dude! I spaghetti the inputs! I spaghetti the inputs! Oh god, I don't have any more ammo. Oh god, I didn't have any more ammo. That was bad. Oh, we almost got there, but that was bad. That was big spaghetti. That was mega spaghetti. Spaghetti. And I always go at night. Always, always, always. I don't know why I always go at night. Okay, that was big spaghetti. Um, you guys don't have any ammo. I don't have any ammo either. I'm gonna finish these off, maybe? But I don't have any more ammo for you. Ay, 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 ay. Can I finish these off or do I need to come back? Oh. So close. Okay. That was really tough. <laughs> but mainly due to spaghetti. It was also a really large base, but the main problem there was big spaghetti. Yeah, the repair sound is not nice, is it? We did it though. Any more ammo? More turrets? You're the monster they tell that your children about. Maybe I should turn the sound effects down. I'm kind of thinking if I just turn the game effects a little bit down, every because everything else is nice. The only thing I want a little bit softer is the effects. Thanks, Atori. Welcome, welcome. Oh yeah, I want to try the combat. Oh no, I don't have combat drones. I have defense drones. I want to try those out. But um, importantly, we have a train path now, potentially along the coast. Sounds like it might be nice. Maybe just gotta get rid of this one. We're getting rid of that one. I do think that we need to get a lot more ammo. Solid pollution core there. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. So much pollution. Oh, did I forget some turrets? Can you see them on the map? 
I don't know what turrets look like on the map. Forgot some turrets. Is it these? Or these. I forgot one, two, three, four turrets right here. I see. That's okay. I'll um, come back for him later. He says, never returning again. Can I make the pump jack? I don't think I have oil done yet. Yeah, I don't have oil processing done yet. So can't get this oil yet. But soon we'll have that oil. Yeah, I guess I made it a lot harder on myself by not starting on a map that had um, more trees nearby. I think that's probably why my second run was easy. So I, I think that this map was hard, was much harder than... Oh, look at that. We are like maximum steel product or iron production now. This is really nice to see. Uh... The little robots waving their arms. Yeah, I love it. So we're backed up on grenades over here and red ammo over here. Good. I get a lot more red ammo. Science is sciencing. Wait, we're actually stopped on red now. That's wild. We can fix that pretty easily though. Red just need. We're not coppers. We got plenty of. Um, let's just make these into. Yeah, we're just stopped on production. So let's get more red. There we go. That'll fix that problem, I think. Yeah, I think that'll fix that problem in due time here. We'll come back and check on it soon. Belt some inserters. I'll grab some of these. That'll mess it up for a minute, but that's okay. Okay, we made 32 engines. Um... We can make the trains. Arithmetic decider combinator. I haven't played with these at all. Circuit networks. I haven't played with the circuit networks at all. Programmable speaker. Plays alarms and musical notes or shows alerts. Can you make music in this? That's so sick. But we can make a locomotive. We have the necessary stuff to make our first train. And we can make a train stop this time too. That's huge. We never had those train stops. I wonder what the storage tank is. Maybe for uh, fluids? And... Looks like we'll have the uh, oil stuff coming in. These are the barrels to fill stuff up with. And we have gates. I never make gates. Mainly because I don't feel like I have enough walls. Oh, I meant to place a radar over there. That was what I wanted to do. I forgot. We can go back and do it. Uh, we need more red ammo. And I'm probably going to need to keep stealing these. Probably keep stealing those. Um, oh, I actually am out of copper plates. Interesting. Oh, the copper isn't even doing anything. No, it is doing something. No, it is, is it? Do you even need copper? I think this is the last place it's being used. Well, nonetheless, I'm skimming some copper. skim some copper. Actually, I might have some copper in my chest. Add a chest for them. I already have a bunch, though. I guess maybe they'll come in handy later. Alright. Um, we can start building the trains. God, look at the pollution. This is like an unstoppable polluting field of doom. <laughs> we're pretty safe for a while down here, but oh my God, we're just encroaching on everything over here again. My plan was to take out this base and then go all the way up here to this iron and put radars up here. It seems like a sick plan, I think. I like that plan. And then we can, what I want to try this time is piping the oil in to the base and making like flame towers. That sounds fun. Train stops. Yeah, here comes oil processing. Oh, you know who play without biters because I find them tedious? 
if you did enjoy the shortish crass landing oh a spe specific scenario um i like them because uh i like them because it sort of is like giving me a goal to work towards there is a tiny iron yeah there's a tiny iron right here i could just go get it Eighty-two thousand. i mean it's not nothing but I want to train to 4.2 million iron. <laughs> That's what I want. And you officially have no idea what's happening. Okay, I'm gonna get cinnamon. I'm gonna give you the quick. I'm gonna give you the quick rundown. All right, let's see if we can find any corpses. There we go. See these? These are bug corpses that have been trying to penetrate my defenses. So this is kind of like a tower defense. All right. We got these turrets that are protecting us, but the bugs keep evolving and getting better. So we need to, um, I'm, I'm about to get flamethrower turrets. And to do that, I have to go to this oil right here. There's, I can't see it on my radar, but there's oil right here. And I'm gonna have to like pipe it into my base and then something, 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 flamethrowers. Um, so that's something that we're trying to do. Another thing is I have these little guys and these are like mining coal and these guys are mining iron. And all that stuff is getting filtered through the base to make things. So these guys take the iron and they convert it into these iron plates. And then the iron plates all come down to here. And there's like a big massive thing of iron plates. And then like these guys take the iron plates and make ammo. These guys make gears. We can make engines. We can make pipes. We can make all sorts of stuff. Uh, and all this stuff is just different things that we need to make. Um, these are my labs, my science labs, and they're giving me new technology. So I'm researching the ability to get oil right now, but then we can make like, we, but the main thing I want to do is make trains. So we're going to make some trains in a little bit here too. So that's generally what's going on. I need to go make trains in order to get more resources. Siggy, they have the 57 months. They say, I'm very sorry to hear about Ruby, Carl. My thoughts and prayers are with you. Thank you, Siggy. I really appreciate that. I miss Ruby. I was sad earlier today thinking about Ruby. Thank you. Ruby was my cat that died a couple weeks ago. How much ammo do I have? Kind of not enough to push. I'm going to go get some more ammo and then I think we'll try to... Oh, maybe I should get... Maybe I should just start building a train track. <laughs> Why not just start building a train track? What are we missing for train? We're not missing anything. I just need some stone and some steel. Let's start building some train tracks. Here, I'm just gonna skim this and build it manually, I think, because it's gonna be faster. And then we can automate it later once we start using more trains. Um, I have a ton of stone in a chest. Did you come up with that steam power plant layout? Ooh, steam power oh the I, I thought you meant I for some reason I, th I heard steel um, this one well I did this I think on my very first game I did this and then I put three of them and then chat helped me to know that three of them is too many so chat helped with the two there um, the coal is mainly a result of spaghetti and it just kind of worked out. I used to have chests here and I put coal in it manually. And then while we were automating all that stuff, I was like, wait, I just put the coal there. <laughs> so that was kind of the evolution of that. Uh, I needed some stone. That is the optimal arrangement. I think the tutorial had something similar. Um, okay, what do I need to make these? I need to go steal some electronic circuits. Yoink. Wait, where? Yeah, I think you were barely even making stuff because I didn't really need to. Um, all right. I am going to make rail. Oh, um, going to make rail. Going to make iron sticks. 
Why don't you make iron sticks for me? What does it need? Just iron. Please make iron sticks for me. And then what else do I need for these train tracks? And I already got steel plates. Cool. So we just need to put sticks in. Then the train tracks will be coming. All right. Oh, that makes so fast. Wait, that builds so fast. I guess I'm going to make some iron sticks too. Iron sticks. Glad to see the factory was calling to you. There's another layout with pipes between the steam engines. Saving pole saves poles if using burner inserters. The stream layout. That's cool. I don't really understand how else to do it. <laughs> the speedrun variant, which is fastest to place down. Okay, ton oh, these make so fast, these rails. This is very, very good. Excellent. Yeah, they get made so fast. Cool. All right. Maybe it's time to start doing train things. Maybe time to start doing train things. sticks I don't know how much rail I'm gonna need to get up there and I also don't know if I should put the rail in yet or if I should like clear this out first maybe I'll clear that one Go up there, place the radar, see what it's over there. Maybe, what is that? Is that an island with dudes on it? That's concerning. <laughs> what is that? Uh, maybe I'll go over there, place the radar, and then build the train track on the way back. Yeah, let's just ride the train back. Let's build, let's build the rail there and then ride the train back. That sounds sick. Um, we're gonna need to build a locomotive. So we need some steel plates for that. I don't know how much rail I need. Got a couple hundred rail though. That's probably close to what I need. Need a bunch of steel plates. Build the locomotive. Let's go. And then I'll probably build some train stops. Go steal some more circuits and things. Probably should have made, made a circuit maker at some point. Are there tons of circuits just sitting in here? No, they don't really accumulate in there. You guys need probably more stone. Do I need more rail? Let's just see what how much how this rail how far this rail gets us. 400 ish. And I made the train. Right here's the train. Oh God, <laughs> we have a train. Uh, train can go there. Why do I want the train to come? If a train's gonna deliver iron, if the train just came over here, I could easily just connect it to my iron. So how about I have the train come in right here? Let's start, let's start laying the train rail right here. Maybe we can unload it over here or something. Train. I'm um, doing great. <laughs> how do I do this shit again? <laughs> Not like that. I forget how you build with the train. Oh, it's gonna go like that. It's kinda crazy. I guess the train can go through a gate. Maybe I should just have it come in straight then this 
for once in my life, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna build the gate. I'm gonna build the gate. How do we use the gate? Gate. Yeah, the gate. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Nice. Um, do I think I can take off of my bars down there? I don't really ever use those. Put it there. Okay. Let's somewhat follow the code. Oh shit, that doesn't work like that. Huh? Oh, whoa. Dude, I love the train. That's my train track. Let's go. Let's go the trains. I don't even know where I'm going. Wait, let's look at the map and actually try to find where I'm going. Ish. Go, my train, go. Jank train, the spaghetti train. Zoom out a bit, nah. Spaghetti train. <laughs> All aboard the Spaghetti Express. All aboard the Spaghetti Express. Um, do I want to go through the trees here? Nah, coast. Coast is safer. The coast is clear. Oh, we actually finished all of our research. Holy shit. Uh, flammables. Yes. It's rail signals. Yes. I don't know what it does. Sulfur processing. Yes. Fluid wagon. Get it all. Plastics. Hell yeah. Solar energy. Hell yeah. Concrete. I don't know what that does. Let's get it. All right, cool. Um... Might need to choppeth the forest to go through here. Rail signals are a rabbit hole. Excellent. The train. I'm so happy we're getting trains going again. So last game, we basically built the train and then never used it and then died. <laughs> so hopefully it goes better this time. Um, this way. Oh, you're in the way. Get out of here. Thank. Thank. Break the trees so I can place my train. Train to train, train, train. I can't tell what tree is in the way. Oh, there's like a tiny one. The research is happening so fast now. It's so awesome. Wait, the iron's right up here, isn't it? We're almost there. Almost there. Rail signals are the first wall people hit. Okay, I don't think the train needs to go any more than this. I think I can just mine the iron, send it through a belt right down here, and there's my train, and we're good to go. Oh, I gotta get the cargo train. Do I have that? I need to get the cargo wagon. Thankfully, I was able to make it. That was pure luck. <laughs> Completely unplanned. Um, I am also going to do a couple things here. I really want to make a radar up here. So let's um, let's get some power. Do I have um, power things? Offshore pump. Let's make a pump. And um, I forgot I'm gonna have to put coal in it, but luckily I had some coal. And let's place a boiler. And is a steam engine going to fit right there? Tis not. So let's use some pipes to connect everything. What do I, let's see, do I have some pipes on me? I think I had a ton of pipes in a chest that I forgot about. Um, boiler. Put the coal in, make a little chest of coal for now. We'll come back later for this. And then we need a power line. How about a medium power line? Hell yeah. 
medium power line. Okay. Um, I want to put a radar here. Start on two radars. Hopefully that helps things out with that radar. Really like that though. All right. Um, let's see. What is all this shit? Oh my god, I hate it. Why are you on small worm? Why are you on that island? Get out of that. It's cool when you have the radar down, you can actually zoom into a place and like see it. You can see a part of this with the radar. Small biter. There's a uranium ore patch up there. Okay, cool. Heck. Give me that. Please. You can do the thing. Break. Break the thing. Okay. Uh, so much ore here. There's just like unlimited iron here. If we can actually get this. The funny inserter. God damn it. I do this every time. <coughs> I do this literally every time. Okay. For now, let's just make a couple of these boys. That's right, that's why I need to maybe destroy this. But, um, for now. Let's just get some iron onto the train. Oh, we're gonna have to smelt it here too, aren't we? Or do I want to? It probably makes more sense to make the bars and shit the bars in, doesn't it? I don't think I really thought this through. Of course. Oh, that can go under the ground like that? That's crazy. Okay, probably not the right way to do this, but I don't care. We'll make smelters later. For now, I have a train and I'm happy. How much can we load up into the train? Locomotive. Let's put the cargo car down. Cargo car. So if my train comes here, I can have some nerds load up the train. Underground belts go under the ground. I'm surprised it went, hey. Every time. Okay. Ooh, that loads pretty fast. Loads pretty fast. I probably want to uh, I'd probably want to um, smelt these but we're just having fun right now I'll make smelters later after I clear the uh, clear out everything train and then I also have oh I forgot I need um, I need fuel for the train as well fuel okay I also need the Let's see, where is it? I think I have a train stop. What are all my train things? I have a rail signal. Train stop. Maybe I don't have a train stop. I thought I had one. Shoot, did I not make one? Um, Don't think I can do anything about that right now. Okay, yeah, that'll take a long time to load. While that's loading, do I wanna go blow these up? Nah, I don't even care. We'll just bring the train to our base. Um, in the future, how would I... I don't know, whatever. I'll think about it later, I think. Maybe I'll take you and just have you load all this into a chest or something. Yeah, have you load this into a chest while we're gone. Okay. The whole, the thing that really matters is 
Trade! Oh, I went the wrong way. Yeah, trade time. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Train. Oh, yeah. And we're back. God, that's fast. Hell yeah. Look, we have a gate, and then you could just go around the gate down here, and it doesn't matter, but don't focus on that, all right? Focus on how cool the gate is. All right. Um... <laughs> All right, and then let's just set this up because funsies. So, um, I want to probably, I mean, this is like all backed up and unnecessary. Like we don't even need any more iron coming into this right now. <laughs> Can I fix this clog? Why are we so clogged on just the iron? They're just using it at max capacity. We don't even need the iron. <laughs> Uh, maybe if I, oh, I think we don't need the iron because, like, these are backed up. Probably something is backed up. Or, like, by backed up, I mean, yeah, here we go. Like, there's just nothing being produced here. But I actually want some of these for myself. Um, I think I can also make a chest there to fix that. Something, something, something. That will, like, skim off of this. Put the limiter, maybe. Let's do that. Um, how would I do it? Will the <coughs> will the inserter only grab from one of them? If I put a chest here. Will this inserter only grab grenades? Or will you grab those two? Oh, you'll grab those two. Nice. Okay, cool. We just make one stack of each. Two stacks of each. Our. Okay. I wish I could specify which thing. Um, okay, I want it like that. <coughs> I want it like that. Okay. Um, I'll take some of these too, just to get iron production moving again. And I should do the same thing with these. I should do the same thing with stacks of these. So you should just give me some of these, but not too many. You should fill this up, but like two stacks or something. Okay, that'll help. Um, middle mouse button. Oh, Q, right? I gotta use Q. I always forget to do that. I need these pipes. I uh, don't need more rail, but I think I need more engines actually. So let's just, um, let's make some more engines. So I have engines and stuff ready. All right, nice. And let's do the similar thing here. I want both of these things. So you guys, oh, if I put it at the end of the line too, it's only gonna take stuff at the end. Now you're gonna preferentially just grab those. That's annoying. Is there some way to make this nerd grab one and then the other or is that just not happening? But I need uh, two separate ones. If this gets filled up, will you grab the other one? Oh, you nerd. Okay, this one's only gonna give me those then. Which I, didn't I already have, do I already have one of those? No. Okay, fine, you just, you give me those, that's fine. Filters maybe? Hmm. Maybe I'll try the filter inserter. I've literally never tried it. Oh, uh, we're still getting wrecked down there. Wait. Oh, I did it wrong. Shit. Um. Fine, I'll do it here. Okay. Yeah, just so I'll have some circuit boards for me, and then I'll have some of these for me. All right. I should have done that a long time ago. I don't know if I need the copper wires. Maybe I could use the copper wires, but whatever. <laughs> all right, now maybe I actually have a use for all this iron. Engines, huh? Nice. 
Nice. Okay, lots of engines coming in. Lots of ammo. I think you guys are not even getting attacked anymore. I think you guys aren't getting attacked either. Yeah, you guys aren't. Anything that still has old ammo is. Yeah, and you guys are getting fucking devastated. Alright, so let's, um. Make some adjustments here. Hopefully that'll help. May as well fill these up because this is kind of where like the main attacks are coming in right now. Okay. How are you guys doing? Doing okay. Carl, look at the look at the purple inserters. Okay, I've never tried them yet. Let's finally do it. Do the purple inserters. Oh, I could use all the oil things now. Lots of nice stuff coming in here. We got basic oil processing. We can go get some uranium too. Sounds fun. Um, let me go grab my, uh, I don't think this is even serving a purpose anymore. These guys are like inner defenses, but who knows if it really matters. Um, let's go ahead and get some fast inserters. Fast boy. And you guys will unload the train. Probably don't put that there. Um, this is why I want the medium tower, huh? Because you can actually power everything from one away, which is nice. Okay. And let's bring this, I don't know, somewhere, whatever. Too far away, I guess. What? <laughs> All right, whatever. Um, oh, this is like already filled up. Like it doesn't even matter. I probably need to just make iron plates. I suppose I could, no, no, I think I'm gonna just make iron plates and smelt it. So I want this to go somewhere where I can also then later put it into iron plates instead. I can bring it all the way over here and just put it into my iron plate production or something. We'll see. Maybe it's beneficial to not build, to not make all the um, uh, pollution up at the actual other mine though. I mean, I still have the drills there. Missing underground belts. Let's make some underground belts. More circuits. All right, I need to go grab circuits. Where the, uh, where the line ends is a good place to smelt it to plates. Coal is already there. Yeah, that's true. That's a good point. Why are you getting... Oh, because there's not always... You're doing what I want the other one to be doing. <laughs> you, what a nerd you are. I don't have enough of these being made. Um, let's make more. How can I do that in an actual, functional, non-spaghet way? Good, so good, going good so far. <laughs> Wait, are we actually getting attacked over here? What the heck? Oh, because we're polluting this now. Sweet. All right. Nonetheless, um, purple inserter. <laughs> okay, fine. Let me try it. Whitelist, blacklist. Oh. Whitelist? What? There we go. Okay. That makes it preferentially grab those. But I need to make more of them anyway. I need to make more of them anyway. 
Because it's just filtering them off and then we're not getting any production there. Um, okay. I don't know if this is going to work. <laughs> but we're going to make some hot spaghetti one way or another. So we got that to look forward to. Hot spaghetti. Um, there's like no way this is gonna work. I need to just move it all down here or something or up there. It's all bad. It's all bad. Wait, wait, maybe it's not so bad. What if I... Okay, what if you make those? And you take those. No, brain, brain is empty. <laughs> brain is empty. <laughs> um, <laughs> what if you make those? Oh my God. You take those. And good God, there's no room. This is why I, I needed to make more of these. Now I know this is never gonna work. This is never gonna work. I can't get it in there. All right, just take these and fucking do anything with it. And then we'll do something, we'll figure out something to do with it later. All right, you take that. This is, here comes the spaghetti. Y'all ready for this? We're about to get some hot spaghetti right now. It's happening. Holy shit. Um, where are you going to put those? Where are you going to put that? <laughs> I don't fucking know, man. This is trash. Oh. Uh, okay. What are we... No, no, no. Don't go there. Um... Oh, fuck me, dude. Uh, okay, we could just make a bunch of them here. Yeah. All right. All right. Now we can make more of them here. The hot spaghetti is ready to be served. You guys can make... <laughs> oh, this game got so much more fun when I just embraced trash all right now you guys can make these i forget which button to push not that button clearly that's the right button all right there we go now we have circuit production finally oh that needs steel too um well surely that's fixable like right here all right <laughs> Uh, you just go into there. Oh, sometimes it's too easy. <laughs> sometimes it's too easy. Go back in time and forget a lot of the optimization. <laughs> uh, I now understand spaghetti code. What are you being limited by? I don't even fucking know. What are you being limited by? Oh, I need another. You just need to be a blue inserter. That'll help. Maybe even two of them. All right, now these guys can go, can meet back up with this hell. <laughs> oh my God. Oh yeah, there we go. <laughs> oh yeah, get in there. Oh my god. All right. <laughs> Fucking hell.
amazing. Incredible. That's a juicy meatball on this spaghetti. <laughs> oh, I love this game. All right. Uh, you should replace the inserter that puts gears in a chest with a filter inserter as well. Yeah, probably. <laughs> uh, only give me gears. We're like loaded on gears now. All right, sick. And now I have tons of these to use. Feels like those are always coming in handy. Ice. We're researching so many things. Is anything uh, bottlenecked right now? With science juice production? Green. Okay, we still need more green science juice, but that was because of... Oh, that's because you're stealing all those. Do I need more of these, or is the problem gonna sort itself out? Um, would you guys benefit from having another inserter here? Oh, we actually need more copper. We need more of these, don't we? That's the problem. Um, and what's the problem with, oh God, there's like no way for, see what I need is if I just had everything shifted down by like one, I would actually have room to do shit. I can make like a line of these and it wouldn't be so trash. Uh, but here we are in hot trashville. Instead, top inserters need to be fast. Oh yeah, these guys, huh? Maybe that would help. Oh, yeah, that's what we need. Oh, uh, we actually need more copper plates coming in. Let's fix that too. Now, more copper plates. More copper plates. Oh, I can make better furnaces too, can't I? Okay, there we go. More copper plates coming in. We also might... No, we don't need more copper ore. Mmm, the tangled wires of doom everywhere. You love to see it. Can I produce... Can I change these to these, these guys too to make even more copper plates? I think I can. Okay, more copper plates. Uh, you're running low, but I've got tons of copper left, so whatever. If that runs out, then I'll produce more of those. But yeah, we're still, like, maxed out on on iron, too. Look at that. We just have max iron. I'm going to skim some of that so that I have some plates for me to use. Speaking of which, let's fill up a thing of iron plates. Why not? Stacks of iron. Okay, nice. Yay! All right. Um, let's see if that actually. Oh yeah, these guys. This guy is cooking now. You're cooking too. some transport belts. Thankfully, there's some transport belts sitting right here. Plastic's almost done. Um, I still feel like I might need more of these copper wires. That's weird that those guys are showing up there. No, it's not because of this problem over here. Okay, what should we do next? Do you feel like I should maybe solve this still even slightly more? Because more science production is good. I don't think that actually mattered. This guy is still not getting any copper wires. So... Um... If I got copper wires here. 
Uh, hold on a second. Wait, I see. I see the vision. I see the vision. <laughs> wait, wait, backwards though. I see the vision. I see the vision. Wait, the vision. I see it. I see it all. Oh my god. This is e this is an easy solve. <laughs> Oh my god, dude. Easiest solve of my life. <laughs> I love fucking love this game. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, wrong way on the belt. Uh, the spaghetti factory is so re oh yeah there we go <laughs> oh shit oh yeah the spaghetti factory is real hmm <laughs> oh my god I'm happy with this one never mind it's perfect. All I did was enable this one extra one here, because you're already working at max capacity. I mean, we're still not even making, like the inserters are back. Look at this, the inserters are backed up. Green science juice production has never been hotter. I think once it fills up, we'll be backed up on green science juice too. It's just got some time, it needs some time to catch up. So maybe I make a, maybe not. Maybe let's make one more green science juice. Wait, was that the wrong? That was the wrong type. We want these. I don't have time for these crappy ones anymore. More green science juice. More green science juice. It's perfect. Wait, why do I have two of those? I don't need two, I just need one. Yeah. Perfect. More green science juice. Is that actually enough green science juice? Maybe we still need more. I guess I could let it cook for a second and see if it catches up, but let's make another one. More science juice. More science juice. Yeah. All right, now the green science juice is coming in. Make the spaghetti you want. All my bases ultimately devolve into the same boring shape. At least this spaghetti is interesting. Godspeed. I love the spaghetti. <laughs> uh, who wants the base to be the same every time? <laughs> no, I, I wanted to have some hope, but then, but then I want to sprinkle in and by sprinkle in, I mean have a large helping of the massive spaghetti on top. <laughs> when more green circuits are needed, just cook more spaghetti. It's fine. Exactly. Exactly. There's always time for more spaghetti. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> this fucking just backed up train of doom that is... <laughs> Oh, uh, this massive just glut of... Wait, it's also a glut because I never finished it. <laughs> Fuck. Not that we need it, anyway. Why is there one plate on that, anyway? Alright, there we go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we can't even use it. It's all maxed out. <laughs> I love this. This is my favorite. Like, oh, they're on the wrong side. Well, let's just fucking wrap it around and then... <laughs> Fix it over here. <laughs> I fucking love that. This is the spaghetti right here. Oh, it looks like we need our third inserter boy back. <laughs> oh, easy solve. <laughs> oh, I fucking love this. This is what coding is like, isn't it? <laughs> this is what coding is like, isn't it? All right. Um, I actually do need. Uh, red ammunition to be building up. Yeah. Um, wait, you fucking failed me. But maybe you didn't fail me, actually. Are you just gonna keep giving me grenades? Yep, you failed me. <laughs> Alright. I have 300 grenades. 
you are you need to be a purple purple inserter you need to be a purple inserter that really really likes uh that thank you very much oh there we go um honestly like a lot of that ammo is really good so maybe like a lot yeah a lot <laughs> we're full up on that anyway oh my god the grenades are just completely backed up but that's good that's good it means we got a lot of it all right cool what should we do next <laughs> This is like junior C++ dev creating everything from zero <laughs> using three inserters so they could do a zero. I am curious what the solution to this is without the inserters. I couldn't figure it out. <laughs> how to get them to, how to get them to like rebalance. Oh. It's super simple. Oh, well, the problem is I don't know what to use, like, because I don't have any space, really. Um, oh, I think somebody, sh somebody mentioned this on my first day. You do it with another splitter, right? How do you do it? I don't remember where the other splitter goes. Oh, maybe it's... Hmm. Um. <laughs> Fuck me, dude. Uh. Uh. Uh, <laughs> wait, 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 wait. That's only gonna go to the bottom. If I put it here, it only goes to the bottom. So it needs to, but what does that do? <laughs> Fucking nothing, right? Wait, that doesn't, no. Fuck. Um, is that a splitter? Maybe I need it. Fuck. What does it need to do? Okay, wait, maybe, 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 because now it's on the right side, and then I split it back in. Damn it! <laughs> that did nothing! <laughs> that did nothing! That's not it! Uh, fuck. <laughs> T junctions. T junctions. Uh, do I have the? Because I, I I know how. Obviously, I know how to do it if I can come from above. The problem is that I can't come from above. Or I mean, I probably can spaghetti my way from above. But without spaghetti my way from above, is there some way to come from below and still have this work? That's what I'm wondering. You have more. Uh. Okay, we go, we bring you down to the bottom. We bring... <laughs> nope, still. Um, <laughs> wait, oh God. Where do I want, what do I want the splitter to do? Cause well, this will still just put it on the bottom, right? It still just puts it on the bottom. Wait, that's not even doing anything. Fuck me. Oh my god. What if... If this is like this... Fun! Oh my god, dude. It's so close! Oh. I think I found every wrong way to do it. Uh, splitter was right. Oh, do you mean this? Do you mean this splitter was right? The thing is, is I never get it to go to a different lane. That's the problem. 
I never get it to go to a different lane. So you can't put two splitters right next to each other. Oh, you can. What does this do? Whoa! So it's... Let's... Wait. Or maybe I don't want that. Is that wasting iron? No, it's not waste. Is it wasting iron? No, it's fine, right? Um, Because this one's not doing anything. It's only going to the bottom, but it's all would be going... I guess that works. <laughs> uh, it's slightly problematic that these nerds are still putting it on the bottom, though. But... Actually, wait. This will have more... No, no, no. It's already on the bottom. I don't want that one. That's more on the bottom. There's still more on the bottom, but you only need one splitter. What? <laughs> Which one do I need? What? Do you need the first splitter? Uh... Wow, I'm dumb. Oh, they're like feeding into the same belt. I get it. I get it. I get it. But the second splitter makes it look fancier. All right, I think it's good enough. Holy shit. Um, all right, the good news is, is while that spaghetti was going on, we should have a whole bunch of ammo waiting for us here. Boom, 300 piercing rounds, let's go. Do you want the most efficient solution? I'm curious what it is, yeah, now that I have my spaghetti. I could do the same thing again. Cause yeah, these guys are, these guys are clogged. We can just do the same thing again, right here. Oh, ho, 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 ho. still clogged. Wait, that's not the same thing, is it? Shit, uh, like this. Wait. Fuck. No, that's not the same thing. That's not the same thing. <laughs> I've not made it better. I've not made it better. Uh, put a splitter. Uh, put a splitter next to the inserters you are standing under, where you have two open slots. Set it to output priority left, and have the belt curve back. Have the belt curve down back onto the main belt. Yeah, okay, I think you mean right here. Uh, or for, I could do it any of these places, right? Uh, uh, the most efficient way is a splitter on the inside. Fits with the other power poles. The cheap way is side loading from the inside. Splitter on the inside. Do it from the top, move the power pole. Replace, replace the splitter with a single belt. Why didn't we just do that? Oh. <laughs> uh, okay. If I didn't have, if I only had this much space, I couldn't do that, right? It wouldn't work from here. Oh, but I could just make this underground and then I would have space. Hmm. Still want to learn more about the splitters though. All right. Oh my God, we actually finished everything. Explosives, batteries, advanced electronics, flamethrowers, defenders. Nice. Oh my god, we have so much stuff. Okay, um, I'm gonna take a quick break to use the restroom. Still not an ideal balancer, but I suppose it works. Oh, watching chat talk to us while watching nine ads. I'm sorry. Um, I am gonna use the restroom and then let's like do something actually. 
<laughs> useful. Let's see. What should we do? Maybe um, maybe get the oil and pump it to the base. Um, maybe blow up one splitter nest and then pump the oil to the base and try to make flame turrets. The flame turrets look cool. I've never made them yet. Check your tips. Oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We probably want to do the train stuff, too. But I don't need the iron yet. We'll come back to the train stuff when I actually need the iron. Or else I could increase the iron production. Will we set up an automatic train <laughs> by 27 on the clock? I am loving Factorio. Yeah, it's really fun. Really going to try to get my friend Juz to play it. Okay, we can get a car now. That might help. We all know it's not going to help. I'm just going to crash the car into everything. Let's go get the oil. Something I need to figure out is how, <clears throat> how to do the flame turrets. I want flame turrets. They have explosives too. I do think it's kind of problematic though that the... That those... Um, these guys are kind of coming right through where the oil would go. Maybe. Uh, 22 turrets. Yeah, 32 would be enough. I want more turrets. Can I make the car? I think I need some more iron plates. I've got a bunch of junk in my inventory. Let me clean it out. Oh, I can like feed more iron into that from there. Cool. Uh, let me get some junk out of my inventory. I've got far too many of these now. Don't need you, don't need you, don't need you, don't need you. One random damage inserter. I should go, whatever. Just get it out of my inventory. Okay, that's better. Grab some iron plates. Snag some iron plates. I think we're good to go. Yeah, I want to try learning more about the oil. This one's out. We got plenty of iron. We're not concerned. I'm going to be more concerned when the coal runs out. Oh, there's like a whole big army coming, but I have grenades, so... Get wrecked, nerds! Let's take out this base here. Wasn't I gonna make a car? Let's make a car. Probably should hotkey the car. I don't need, I don't need a coal hotkey anymore. It doesn't serve any purpose. Um... Uh, don't actually have any coal for the car, so <laughs> not using it right now, but I don't think I need to use it right now. All right, the oil's right here. Let's definitely get rid of these nerds. This one I can probably just take care of manually. Ooh, this was a medium spitter, I think. It definitely feels like it's uh, both hurting me more and... Please die. Okay, get rid of these nerds. I think we probably need to get rid of this one too, and maybe this. This is like a city. <laughs> I don't know if I can get rid of that one, but maybe we should get rid of this one, and then we'll probably be safe with our crude oil. You initially didn't like the graphics. What do you think now? Um, I understand a lot more. Like when people said that many people could play multiplayer and also when I realized that it was kind of designed to be viewed from more zoomed out, it makes more sense. I was looking at the graphics like zoomed in and it's kind of like, eh, like it doesn't look very good. Um, but the other thing I'll note is that when you have a like functioning um, factory, the graphics I think look really good. So like, I really like the animation and how everything looks when you actually have a factory going. So it just, I just think I was kind of judging the wrong part of the game. Also, I'm assuming a small team worked on the game. Oh, this is like in the trees. Look at them get so stuck in the trees. Hmm. 
It would be nice to leave the trees. All right, here's what we're gonna do. Place a couple of turrets here just to get rid of these while I uh, get set up. And then we're gonna push in with a buttload of turrets once this wave gets cleared. Okay, here we go. That's how we do it. That's how we do it. Does turret ammo have a limit? Yeah, I actually have to physically put ammo in it. Uh, there's only a certain amount they can hold too. So I'm like, I have to place the turrets and then I have to actually put ammo in the turrets. It's pretty tricky. They can only hold 200, but I'm not putting anywhere near that much in it. I'm just putting a couple in it for them to shoot because I only have 400 on me so if I put 200 in each I would be able to fill up two turrets oh there's like a whole big city over here don't know if I should kill this one or not I mean I am here it might be a little tricky but it's also going to be in the way of, way of our oil and our train, so I'm gonna I'm gonna get rid of this one too. Getting a lot better on the hotkeys. All right, and then we move in. <laughs> we got so much better at this. Let's go. You can automate reloading. You can. Yeah, the key is to just keep building more turrets as fast as you can, and it overwhelms them so fast. It makes a huge difference. No, you normally just strafe with the car for like three minutes. <laughs> I, I liked how you could throw grenades from the car. That seemed, um, that seemed pretty cool. I did lose some turrets. I mean, while I'm here, I kind of want to just blow up that one. Don't I have radars up here? Did my radar get destroyed? Don't I have a radar up there? I think it's there still. I guess it's just, oh, it's slowly revealing right here. Maybe I should have put more radars. Um, all right, I'm gonna take out this one because it's the last one that will pose any threat in this particular area. Maybe I should put another radar like right there. Hmm. Maybe if I get solar panels, I can just drop some solar panels and then place a radar. Do I have solar panels? Production. Solar panels. During daytime, it produces 100% of the power output, which drops to 0% at night. I wonder if there's a way to store the power from the solar panels. Hmm. Uh, but this is kind of a smaller base down here, so I'm just going to get rid of it. Uh, oh, they ran out of power because of the coal. Yeah, that's right. How was I going to solve that? Solar panels? <laughs> hmm. Stop killing my turret. Yeah, I gotta kill that nerd because it's killing my turret. And then I think we're just about ready to push here. Get this wave down. Oh my god, the the spitters that slow you down even more are the freaking worst. The guy can't stop. You gotta keep adding more. Just 
the only way. Okay, nice. Whew. I think they might be evolving more. Oh, you left a few turrets. Whoops. Yeah, I left turrets the other time too. I keep forgetting about them. Get these turrets. All right, let's get our oil. I can see the turrets, right? Yeah, I have turrets here, here, and there that I've forgotten about. Landfill. Yeah, I saw that I can fill in land, but have not uh, looked into that yet. Ooh, okay, flamethrower is coming. And then we want to get the improvements on the flamethrower as well. There's more turrets up there, but whatever. Let's see, I need to get some pump jacks. Um, might have to go... Well, I can do two of them. Okay, here's our oil. Let's, um... Oh my god, please. Let's throw down these pump jacks. I don't... Expected resources. Oh, I can see that there's different expected resources on each of them. For some reason, this one's higher even though it's smaller. I don't know. Uh, we're gonna need to get electricity here, aren't we? Hmm. Good to know. Maybe I should put these turrets somewhere else. I didn't realize I was going to need electricity. Um, solar panels? <laughs> I need more steel plates for that. Okay, I'm going to have to go get some electricity. Maybe I'll build some big electric poles. Modular armor. Armor with a small grid for equipment modules that give you unique bonuses. Wearing it also increases your inventory size. That's sick. Oh, I got to get the new chemical science pack, modular armor, upgrade modules to insert into machines, stack inserter, can move multiple stacks, holy crap, cliff explosives, mining productivity increases the yield from everything. Wow. Um, I definitely want, well, landmines, I want refined flammables, increases the damage of fire, rocketry, personal rocket launcher, what? Holy shit, we're getting to the good stuff. Um, okay, I want all this stuff eventually. We'll wait. Put a radar there. Yeah, I need to get the power first. That's a good idea. How are we doing on power production? It's okay. Um, I gotta go grab a few resources while I'm here. You guys shouldn't get harassed much anymore, now that I destroyed those. Some of these guys still have old ammo. Uh, let's go pick up some... St oh, I made a little chest for this. Yeah, okay. Just grab my chests. Give me that. Give me those. Give me... Yeah, give me those. And then I should take from these chests, <laughs> and then I should I should put them all together into one chest. So I only have to loot one chest, and it just gives me all the stuff that I kind of want in my inventory. Um, pretty sure I had something else that I wanted. Maybe. Let's see what I want to make. Refined hazard concrete. I wonder what all this concrete does. Hmm. No idea what that's for yet storage tanks. I spilled some big electric poles. That sounds fun. Um, 
Oh, I can make flamethrower turrets. Yeah. I can make flamethrower turrets. Okay. We don't need them yet, though. So let's let's keep our supply of regular turrets nice and high. Since those are super useful in a pinch. Okay, let's go get ammo. Do I need more grenades? No, I don't need any more grenades. I just want the ammo. Nice. Very good. You can run faster on concrete. That's crazy. All right, that's cool. Hey, is the iron actually getting used? Kind of. Kind of. Not bad. Um, let's see. We need to make some more of these. Could use some of those. I uh, need to get some belts. Just trying to keep stocked up on everything. Yeah, the flamethrower. Can make 29 flamethrowers. <laughs> Defender capsule. Creates one defender. Robot lifetime 45 seconds. Damage 8 plus 4 plus 8. I wonder what a defender capsule is. We've got to try these. Let's make some defender capsules. Let's make some defender capsules. Um, let's see. What else did I need? There's something else I wanted. Oh, I just need some more iron plates as well. Make some more stuff. I swear there's something else I really wanted to get before I went back there. Let's bring let's bring some power. Try them? Yeah, I will. Advanced circuit. Ooh, plastic bars. Batteries. So many things to make. This is getting crazy. Solar panels sound fun. Let's take our train. Um, I want the radar to keep working up top pretty bad, so let's take the train up there real quick and maybe slap some solar panels or something up there. I'll bring some coal too. I, think I have a bunch of coal hanging out somewhere. Let's uh, just bring a whole buttload of coal up there real quick. On the old train. Oh yeah, the train stops. We gotta do the train stop soon. Make some train stops. Uh, is there a way to turn the train around? Because I don't think it goes as fast back... Or does it go the same speed backwards? Yeah, the train! <laughs> backwards train! <laughs> Yump. <laughs> I like it when it wiggles. Yay. Whoa. Love the train. Sick. Just loop the track around. Oh, okay, cool. That makes sense. Uh, yeah, everything ran out of power, so let's... Try to fix that. Oh, solar panels won't help here because this requi always requires consumable. Doesn't it? The boiler will always need consumable, uh, consumes burnable fuel. So the best thing I could do is put the oil cubes in it to make it last longer. Otherwise, we're gonna need to somehow just get coal up here. Hey, there's coal right there. Wait a second, maybe we do go to that island. <laughs> How do I get to the island? Um, all right, now the radars will go again, which is good. Why are you not satisfied? Because there's two radars there, that's why. Um, an extra steam engine. Are you satisfied now? Yay, you're satisfied. Okay, until I build something else, there's probably no point in making more there. Solar would replace the boiler. Okay, wait, so let's just place a cut. I don't know how many solar panels I'm gonna need, but let's just try some and see what happens. Belt with coal from the main base. I was thinking about it. Let's clear a little bit of room here. I don't know how the solar panels work at all, so we're going to have to just see. 
If it's on the line, does it work? It says generates uh, 60 power out is 60 kilowatts. Now what's the power output of one of these? Like 900 kilowatts. So I would take a couple solar panels to match. But in a pinch, that will still keep everything powered, I think. Which is nice. But until I have a way to store the energy, it won't work at night, so... It'll only have half production. That doesn't really matter right now. I cannot get through there. Interesting. We'll keep the coal inserter powered at least. True. Put three steam generators on one boiler and look at the power lines. Yeah, it's a, it's they can't use it, right? Um. All right, load up my train. Let's try adding the train stop. We haven't learned how to use the train stops yet, and I really want to throw one of these defender capsules too. So let's get these ready. Okay. Um, somewhere here I have a train stop. Oh, wow. Is that like, do I want it, he do I want it here? There are no trains with this stop. Trains with this stop. But I have to do that in the schedule? There's a tip on the street. Train stops. <clears throat> um, used to automate train transportation. No, it looks like I might have done it right. Does it, oh, does it have to, does it touch the front of the train? Oh, it touches the tip of the train. I see. So the train stop would need to go there. Wait. I'm so confused as to why that, what? It's not on, it needs, does it need to be? I was, it was, I mean, that looked horribly wrong, but it, it gave me the weird, like, oh, I see the two cars now. Yeah, so it should be right there, I think. It's ticking. Um, if I add station, add weight condition, full car. Oh, wow. Holy shit. I can have time pass, full cargo, full cargo. Whoa, that's so cool. The trains, the trains, load the trains. Okay. I know I can make the loading more efficient, but I'm not worried about it right now. Um, we're gonna have to go put the other one in first though. Okay, I'm just gonna leave, bye. Yeah, night train, let's go. <laughs> You'll need to move that stop down one square, dang it. <laughs> yup. Okay, let's put in another well, they unload. Let's put in another train stop here somehow. Train stop. This game just got so much cooler. Holy shit. Um. I think I need to make more room. And then 
I can put it over here. It's weird how it shows the, it shows the cars. See how it shows the cars? It looks like I should be able to put it one more further to get to where it is right now. And yet, I don't seem to be able to. Hmm. More rails on the right. Oh, um... Do, oh, I don't have any. No, I do have more. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Oh, I guess it'll stop there. Okay, cool. Um, add station, zero valentine. Yeah, wait condition till empty cargo. I can turn it to automatic now, maybe. No path. No path. Trains can't drive backwards like this. Oh, uh, shoot. <laughs> All right, train's gonna have to do a loop. Stop is inaccessible from the current position. All right, trains only look at the station to the right of their travel direction and cannot travel backwards. Another locomotive. <clears throat> I don't get how to. How is looping it that bad? Uh, you can add a locomotive to the other side of the wagon. <laughs> oh, really? More trains. More trains. Ah. Well, that's pretty cool. The other station is on the wrong side. Okay. I shall fix it. Cool trains. Let's go. Um, so now what will happen if I try to do this? It doesn't give me an error. There's a bunch of nerds coming up here. I guess we're angering these guys. Let's just... Um, let me see how this goes. They got devastated. Nice. Cool. So any possibility of nerds sneaking through right here? Just in case. Oh, this one can't move. Why not? Am confusion. Let's go look. Set it to manual drive. Yeah, okay. We. Well, now I'm gonna have to change this one. Yeah, go my train. Um. Wait, 
Don't I want another loady? Another loading nerd. Okay. Um. Let's do the last stop, I guess. Train stop. Where do I want you to stop then? Like here? Why doesn't it give me the... I'm so confused as to which... Oh... Oh, okay. That's interesting. Um, don't know why that matters. So you're different. There we go. Add weight condition, full cargo, empty cargo. Yeah. Okay. Oh shit, come back! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that means the train could just run into me, can it? Oh shit. Okay, I definitely need pro I need some turrets here so that they can never kill the loading train. That would be annoying. Oh. So let's at least make sure we have a bunch of turrets right here. I do wonder if they may ever try to come around that way, but let's hope to try to go this way, I guess. Lots of ammo. Just in case. here too. Oh, is this a path? No, it's not a path. Okay. I'm so afraid. <laughs> Every time now I cross the- wait, there's a fish in there. Every time I cross the track now, I'm like, uh-oh. <laughs> uh, Alright. Yay, the radar is working here now. That's good. And also help. I wonder what happens if I put two trains on the track and then they run into each other. I really shouldn't follow this train track. You can click on the train remotely on the map. Train! Oh, okay, I could. Empty cargo, cool. That's so cool, I love it. Then we can have multiple trains. That's sick. Let's do the oil now. Let's go snag the oil. I may as well get my turrets down here. You can click on a stop for it to go there. Oh, cool. So I could get the train to come back. You can also see a list of all your trains with a button. Trains. Oh, nice. Two stations, one train. Damn, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah, I can imagine if you had lots of trains overlapping. <laughs> I assume that's what the signals become useful for. I'd still recommend playing the small train tutorial. But I have chat. Right, and the whole point was to get power lines from here and I've completely forgot to do it. Um, let's try the big power poles. I've never used a big power pole before. You can rename the train stations. The Spaghetti Express. I thought this would be... Maybe the next one will be far? Ah, oh, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Big power poles. Big power poles. I 
I hate everything. Uh, all right, we got some oil coming in, and I need to make some more of these pump jacks. Um, and then we need to decide what to do with it. I cannot remember the options. We have oil refinery potential and a chemical plant. I forget. Or maybe I just take the oil as is. Ooh, everything finished. Portable solar panel. Inserted into armor to power other equipment, but useless at night. Modules. Electric energy accumulators. Stores excess electric energy for later. We could use that with the solar panels. Um, mining productivity is very interesting. Landmines. Can be rebuilt by construction robots after exploding. Upgrade can be, damage can be upgraded by researching stronger explosives. I'm going to get refined flammables right now. But rocketry, hell yeah. Follower robot, count one, increases the number of combat robots. Where do I get combat robots from? I don't see combat robots. Unless my defender bot counts as a combat robot. Uh, let's get rocketry coming in. Landmines, mining productivity, explosives, accumulators, modules. Lots of good shit coming in. Okay. I think I need to use pipes for this, but I'm not exactly certain the best way to transport the oil. Let's attempt to use pipes. <laughs> um, pipe to underground. Well, you work. I probably want to combine them all together too. So let's put all four of these on here. Um, the pump jacks. Let's put you and you. What? Oh, it's not connected to that. <laughs> okay. And then um, pipes. Can I turn you? I can absolutely turn you. That would make things easier. Okay. They're feeding each other. <laughs> um. Okay. Got a bunch of, got a series of tubes. Can I run this underground? How will this work? I can only run it to there. Oil pipe. So we can do something like this. Can't run it diagonally, can I? Doesn't look like it. Uh, you can drag. Cool. Oh, okay, okay, okay. That's cool. Um, but I want you to go up. How do I make you go up? Do I have to use a pipe? hotkey these pipes somewhere. What am I not realistically going to care about using right now? You. And then the other ones too. Feels like the underground pipes are the most efficient way. But I don't know. That was wrong. <laughs> what have I done? Um, need some more underground pipes though. He has trains, but still uses long pipes. I don't want to make a train everywhere. I've never even used the oil before. Calm down. Gotta at least figure out what I'm doing, doing with it. Okay, I want to see how the turrets work because I don't understand how the turrets work yet. If this needs to actually go to them or what the situation is with that. So let's try... Also, let's expand the base? Question marks by face? Let's like let's expand the base like all the way down here, maybe even. 
many walls? Let me go grab all my walls. And let's try making some... Flamethrower turrets. I need some stone. I need some walls. Take some of that. Rail signals basic. Copy paste trains. Train stops with the same name. Holy shit. Yeah, we were getting dunked on down here. I gotta be careful. Yeah, but trains. True though. True. But I gotta try all the new stuff. Uh, I've got plenty of that stuff. Uh, there's probably ass loads of ammo up here. Which, honestly, I'm fine with. I need it. Okay, um, could use some of these bars, I guess. Throw the steel plates. Alright, cool. Uh, what do I need for more flamethrower turrets? Oh, I need more engine u units. Uh, let's, let's crank out a couple engine units while we're waiting here. Do I have a pipe maker? Yes, I have my pipes ready. Yeah, let's have this guy cook in more um, engine units while we wait. That'll be useful to have later. All right. This factory is looking pretty good. Yeah, going way better now. We even have a train. We got our first train. All right. Getting attacked over here. Maybe I'll just build the first flamethrower turret over there. Since these nerds are coming in over there anyway. And let's move this. Let's get rid of this. We'll move it down. We'll expand the whole base. Get lots of room. Did you get the achievement for getting your first locomotive within 20 minutes? That's wild. There's no way. There is no way. How about my first locomotive in 20 hours? Thanks, Zephyr. Glad you're enjoying. I'm really loving the game. I don't want to like, like the, in my opinion, the most fun about these games is like when you don't know how to do everything and you're kind of figuring everything out for the first time and it's complete trash and whatever. Like that's fun. That's really fun. Once it's solved, then it's solved, you know? It's kind of fun when it's not solved. And we we'll get rid of this one too. Good morning, uh, stick. Drop down a turret over there and hopefully something attacks us. I don't know, but I gotta figure out how to actually power it with the oil. I don't know if I need the oil to like specifically go into it from this or what, but we're gonna find out. Um, yeah, maybe I'll expand the base downwards first. So I'll keep this the way it is over here. Let's put one of the turrets down and see what it looks like. Oh yeah, I still need more steel plates and engines to make more, but I have one. Let's put the one down. Consumption. Hmm. Holy shit. Whoa. So that's a fucking massive range. Look at that range. I mean, it would be nice to... It would be nice to push the factory out. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let's use the natural border right here, perhaps. Maybe this is what we want to do with it. Maybe this is what we want to do with it. Something like this. 
And then we can push our factory out to the natural border between these two things. Um, I am going to, so this thing doesn't just like immediately get destroyed <laughs> when I'm not paying attention. Um, I'm gonna do that too. <laughs> And then, yeah, maybe we can make a wall up to right here. We'll slowly push the base out. Okay. Okay, um, how do I feel you? Don't know how to feel you. Attacked, like right up here. Hmm. This guy's still using the old ammo. Alright, whatever. Uh, let's bring it down, I guess. Oh, did I use all my pipes? Uh, I used them for something, I think. Oh, screw it. Let's go underground. It costs, it takes so much room if I'm not underground. We're finally, oh, that needs to come up somewhere. <laughs> what? <laughs> Just went down and never came back up. All right. Um, <laughs> oh yeah. Let's go, that's what it needs. I wonder if that'll work. Oh my God, I just wanna put these everywhere now. Mm. Consumption three per second. So this has 99. Oh, it's like the pipes are filled up. Hmm, okay. Let's put another one like right here then. Sick. Let's see. make it look pretty later <laughs> don't worry we'll make it look pretty later uh, <laughs> right now we're just close the gap <laughs> we'll make it look pretty later <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh my god all right perfect Real problem is going to be getting hit from above here. So let's go ahead and wall that. Oh, right there is the choke of our dreams. Right there. Um, at some point, we should just do that. Maybe I should just do that? Then I would have this whole space. Am I allowed to go run up there and just build shit right there? I don't know. It would be so much easier to defend than what we're doing right now, though. I'm not gonna do that right now, but I think that's what we should do next, is to just go there. That's the plan next. Allowed. <laughs> Let's get more flamethrower thingy things though. Need some more steel plates. I miss riding in the train already. I don't want the train to be automatic. I want to ride in it. Oh, is the train? Where's the train at? Yeah, there's the train. Oh, look at the train. Yes. Unload my train, friend. Are we going to need more coal? Nah, we're pretty good on coal right now. 
we doing on iron? A couple of irons are running out, but it's still we're packed with iron. Okay, cool. Well, where's my character at? <laughs> okay, there we go. Take some of these iron plates. I need some steel. Do I need more walls? I'm actually, nah, I still have so many. Yeah, steel plates, that's what I need. I can make five flamethrower turrets. Fuck yeah, let's do that. And I can make the new science juice, but to make the new science juice, we need sulfur and advanced circuits. Uh, advanced circuits are plastic, so I assume that plastic is made from oil. Yeah, petroleum gas. Okay, cool, but we got the oil here now. So we'll get um, plastic and uranium next. But first, let's finish, let's, let's get flames protection up on the base everywhere. Sounds sick. I need more underground pipes. Eh? Oh, it takes forever to make these flamethrower turrets. Actually, it doesn't take that long. It's not bad. More flamethrowers. Yes, more flamethrowers. Hmm. I guess this one can just be like this, maybe? Or is it, or maybe this is, no, 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 this is what we want. I'm worried it's going to get spit. I don't want to like, I don't want it to be able to get spit though. Like if they go right here and spit on it. Um, so maybe that leaves us with this. What's the other one doing again? The other one's right there. This seems pretty good. This seems pretty good. I don't know exactly what the what it's gonna be like when it fires. Hopefully it actually accomplishes something from right here. Um I need more Oh, is it waiting to do all these at once? Waiting to do all those at once. I think I have a bunch of pipes sitting in a chest over here. Let's go get it. Let's replace the wall with nothing but flamethrowers. Here comes an attack up top. I suppose I haven't refueled anything up there in ages, and I should maybe go look. I got 200 pipes just sitting in that. I did not need that many walls. <laughs> um, yeah, I figured some of these guys might be out of ammo. Pretty sure I'm just gonna put one flamethrower all the way up north in this choke, or two of flamethrowers up in that choke. And that's gonna make our life much easier. Just have flamethrowers cover the flamethrowers, it's fine. <laughs> is our copper good? Yeah, our copper is good. Okay, we should have a bunch of engines. Yeah, we got a bunch of engines, but I do need to put these walls away somewhere. I am going to put the walls back. This is far too many walls. Four engines. Oh, I already had a ton. Okay, cool. Got a bunch of engines. I need more regular turrets. Actually, pretty badly. Oh, I'm out of gears. Um, that's okay. I got gears and stuff in here. Do I need anything else? Nah, it looks good. All right. Oh, I need some iron plates, maybe? Yeah, get some iron plates. Let's hook up our thing. Let's hook this up. Yeah, okay, two flamethrowers active. I wish I could somehow test it. I guess there's a some enemies here. Hmm. So maybe we'll anger these. Oh, something's going on over here. How do we want to defend? Oh, there's the train! There goes the train! <laughs> yes! Go, my train friend! Go! Oh, this place is probably going to get attacked, huh? Go, my train friend. Oh, I love it. All right. Let's now focus on um, expanding down to right 
here. Use the natural border here, I think. Ooh, fish. Um, maybe let's go to right here. That'll give me lots of room to expand production. And then maybe to right here. We'll think about how to fix this later, but for now we'll just get some crude crude estimation of what we want and nothing's cur currently attacking from this from any of these directions though so i'm not gonna super worry about this right now yeah i don't th i don't think like i don't think we want another flamethrower here right now well maybe there's something happening over here but currently nothing's getting polluted right here so the only stuff is gonna attack us is up here um Oh, we should still defend it. And then I can move all of these down there. I can move all this stuff down. Satisfactory is more casual experience. Interesting. Factorio is hardcore. <laughs> Uh, the turret range has an overlay on the map. Ooh, I definitely like the turret coverage overlay on the map. I like that a lot. So you can find the gaps easier this way. So this one's this one's out of range. Nice, we've got a full coverage here. You can even see the flamethrower coverage. That's cool. Small gap here, but I don't think that matters. Cool, that's really useful. Oh yeah, Factorio is definitely a lot of micromanaging, which um, I am enjoying right now. But I, you know, I wouldn't want to do that always. I'm so happy we're actually expanding our base and have resources. This this makes me think that my second game was like so easily salvageable, but I just didn't really understand what to do. I think my second game was actually fine. I was just confused about what I needed to be doing. Is there no multi-selection tool? Um, I don't think so. Let's just go to right here. It's so quiet and peaceful now too that we destroyed those nests. It really helped. Uh, Adapter, thank you so much for those gift subs. I really appreciate it. I can't wait for the... Uh, <laughs> I don't know what evolutions they can do, but if they just come flying over my walls at some point, like I'm just thinking mutalisks from, Star, from uh, StarCraft. If they just come flying over my walls into my base, I'm just going to rage quit this game. <laughs> uh... No spoilers. I don't want to know what happens. Oh, there are still some coming in this direction. Thanks again, Adeptor. I really appreciate the support. Thank you very much. All right. This is looking pretty good. Oh, the train stop. Let's go. I freaking love the train stop. Um... I guess let's put more turrets here. Keep them full of ammo. Refined flammables, excellent. 
Uh, did attempt to die based on run or just want to start? I died, but yeah, I was thinking about this would be a good place for a flamethrower. Um, I died, but the base wasn't overrun. I, th I felt like I could make my base a lot better, so that was kind of where I was thinking. Um, yeah, maybe we could put one here and one there for the flamethrowers. Oh, here comes the trade! Yeah! Go, my little trade! Look at that! Oh, yeah! Oh, I love this train! I love the train so much. Alright. We'll have more trains soon. Maybe a coal train would be good to get next. Okay. Can I branch this off? Um, does that work? Yeah. This. Yeah, flamethrower online. Let's go. One big thing to learn in this game is that restarting is almost never necessary. Yeah, I if, I should have just bulldozed some of my base, but like I didn't have coal automated, um, and that was kind of slowly killing me inside. I uh, probably could have, sp knowing what I know now, I could have spaghetti my way out of it, but tear down the old base. Knowing what I know now, that's what I would have done. I think I had more resources than I realized last time, too. I really did. Huge base. So next time we're gonna focus on making a huge base. Um, I gotta defend the top though. There's still a chance I run out of ammo up there. Let's do top defenses next before I worry too much about this because I don't think anything's gonna attack down here anytime soon. Gonna have so much room now. I don't think I need to worry about those guys right now. Let's go, um, let's go secure the north with another flamethrower. Then maybe we can actually, I just want to see the flamethrower. I want to watch it work its magic. Um, get some more pipes, get some more iron plates. Okay, yeah. And then I need copper plates actually all things. I don't think I have a chest of copper plates. Maybe I'll make a chest of copper plates. Let's do that. There we go. Give me like three stacks of copper plates to work with. Nom 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 nom. Nom nom nom. Then tons more ammo. Maybe I just do it. <sighs> Fuck it, I'm going for it. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna cut off the natural choke point up here. It's what makes the most sense. And then I'm gonna have infinite room for this base. Holy crap. This is gonna be sick. I'm just gonna cut off the whole choke point right here. Cardo map radars? Yeah, I do. Oh, um, I missed. I meant to be right here. Shit. Why are those walls all hurt? Why are the walls hurt? Why are the walls hurt? Oh, I guess it just doesn't line up. I need more wall. Uh, I'm gonna have to get the oil up here for flamethrower. So in the meantime, I assume they're just gonna come right straight over here. If I 
had to guess. I don't understand why those walls are all hurt. You're about to build the 12-layer wall. I am not going to build the 12-layer wall. Oh, they were hurt when you picked them up. Okay. All right. I think that's good enough. Let's pick up all of our defenses down here and move everything up there. Or maybe I should leave some defenses at the base just in case the game dicks me with some like, haha, we went under the water. Like imagine they just start pouring in from the ocean. <laughs> if I made a game like this, they would probably pour in from the ocean because I'm an asshole. All right. I need to get some more walls. I have like 7,000 walls somewhere. This thing needs a limiter on it. <laughs> the limiter is we've ran out of space. <laughs> <laughs> Who needs a limiter? Um, I need to heal these guys. Um, repair them. Flying bugs. Please no. Carl, are you usually streaming these times? No. I have a circadian rhythm disorder called N24, non-24 sleep-wake disorder. So my sleep moves around sometimes when it's not controlled well, which is right now. Um... Yeah, I'm not using this sound for anything else, exactly. Mmm, refined flammables. Wait, I gotta get the... I need more of these. And I gotta get the, um... Oh god, I don't wanna... Alright, I'm not gonna go in and repair all of these right now. I'm just gonna repair the ones right in front of the turret. That's all I'm gonna do. One day I'll repair these. Today is not today. Actually, that looking, that's looking pretty good. If we look at the map, the turret coverage is almost complete. That's pretty good. Let's try to get some um, oil up there for a flamethrower. You should place a radar next to this north wall so you can look at the flamethrowers working their magic even when you're somewhere else. All right, that sounds good. Once we get the oil up there, I'll place a radar too. I'll place some power in a radar. Um. Do I have enough underground pipe? No, I don't. I'm missing more iron plates. I don't need this old ammo anymore. It doesn't serve any purpose. Let me just go dump it off. In my chest of miscellaneous crap that I don't want anymore. Oh, this one's actually going! Damn it, we don't get to see it. All right, I gotta go place the radar on both of those. Um, whoops, here we go. A few too many walls, don't need any of that crap anymore. What else don't I need? I don't need this, I don't need that. Coal's pretty good, I don't need that. all that wood though. Okay. Back from AFK. What's up and why is it broken? Things are actually going really well right now. We expanded our base out massively. And we have flamethrowers that we're about to... About to get flaminating with. Wait, did I build these? Oh, they're waiting for these turrets. I need those turrets anyway, so whatever. Dang it, we missed, this. We missed seeing this. Hmm. Fluid damage modifier. It doesn't have any kills yet. So I guess it didn't do anything. Science has stopped. Oh, what have I done? I might have backed stuff up by pulling all those iron plates out. Wait. Oh, this guy is stealing all of these. Um, but why is production of them slowed? Is something slowing production of them? Maybe it's not. Are these, oh, these aren't. These aren't fast. Um, don't I have some fast? 
that's probably... But I mean, I was just... It's because this guy was siphoning them all. <clears throat> um, I don't need any more ammo, so... Can I make you... How do I make you stop? There we go. Stop. <laughs> I think that was the problem. Okay. <clears throat> Right. Oh yeah, I gotta get the oil. Where's the oil at? Hopefully there's enough pipes. Here's the oil. It's a little concerning that if like one of these oil pipes goes down, they're like all dead. Never tell me the odds. Oh, dang it. <laughs> Would have been sick if it just went the whole way. Shoot. Flamethrowers it is. Surely you can't do that, right? No. You can't. <laughs> you cannot. Um, where do we want to put the flamethrowers? Let's see. Alright, here's our flamethrower radius. That looks pretty good. I like keeping the flamethrowers in the back because then the spitters can't get them. Put it there. And let's get another one over here. And then we'll get a radar with power. Let's also put one right here. Maybe. Something like this. Maybe that actually, maybe you want, actually, I think I want this guy getting the edge here. So maybe we'll put a third one here, something like this. So close. <laughs> oh, so close. Yay. All right, flamethrower is active. Um, that doesn't work, huh? Does this work? Okay. Yeah. All right. Let's look at the coverage. So you can see the one flamethrower here, the other one there. I think we just need one more flamethrower here. Good. I don't know if I'm putting them too far back or not. I'm putting them too far back. I might have been. go uh, I have to watch them when something attacks and actually see what's that what is actually happening go poke some biters <laughs> I do want to I'll get the radar and then I'll go poke some just in case how do you enjoy Factorio if you compare it to other games that are similar I don't even know a game that's similar to this. Um, I'm playing Factorio probably different than the way most people want to play it. I'm playing on a setting called Death World, where it, uh, it becomes a bit like a tower defense game where lots of things are attacking you unless you go and deal with them. 
So you're like, you're building and doing all this stuff and constructing these elaborate factory things, which are very fun. But then at the same time, you have to watch out for getting attacked. And that makes it more fun for me. Um, but probably most people don't want to play it that way. But I really, really, really like it. For instance, I have a train. <laughs> Wait, where's my train? Uh, I have a train. There goes my train. Yeah. My train just stopped here and it's unloading the iron. I'm just going through all these belts to go back to the factory because the factory must grow. You just got attacked up north. Dang it, I didn't see it. Um, I need power, ca I need big power cables. I need some copper plates. Are you getting me copper plates, friend? Yes, you are. Let's get some big electric poles and bring them up top. Um, I also need some steel plates. Yeah, I made all this stuff. It was lots of fun. Uh, let me get some steel plates. Only single row walls make you nervous. Double roll. It's fine. My upgrades and ammo are so good compared to... Well, until they evolve. I don't know. But last I checked, they were so good that it was... Uh, it was fine. Oh, we are still needing more um, black science juice. Let me just check real quick what the bottleneck is on black science juice. There, the bottleneck is simply production. So um, in order to get our upgrades faster, I am going to add two more of the three more of these. This will help us get more tech faster. belts to bring in the resources that are needed. Um, and then, there we go. That'll increase our science capacity. Okay. Oh yeah, I gotta stretch a big power, a big electric pole. Um, all the way up here so that we can bring power all the way up here and then we can build a radar and then I'm going to need to get more power production I'm certain okay I got some power up here now Let's build ourselves a radar. How are we doing on power? I have enough though, at least. Do I have some radars in here already? No, let's build some radars. Oh my god, I ran out of gears. <clears throat> what can you do with water? Good question. I, I One thing you can do with water that I know of, and I'm sure there's more because of some of the things, some of the things I've seen. This is my steam plant. Um, I have this offshore pump that's pumping water into the boilers and the boilers are producing steam which run the steam engines and that's how I'm powering everything so these power lines are running the electricity made from the steam power. Alright let's build ourselves a couple of radars over here. Two radars sound nice. Getting ammo in my turrets in case we get attacked. I'll repair the walls right next to these turrets. Sure, we'll triple the wall. Got enough wall for it. Gotta repair my wall. I just want to see the flamethrower go. I might go... Oh, they're actually coming in the corner here. Um, I guess I should put these here then. I think I'm going to go 
poke them in the car, maybe? And then drive back with them? Just so I can see the flamethrower do its thing. The mind blown with the bots. I've seen the bots on the title screen. Are there any, like, big groups of enemies doing anything? I am a little worried that we need to um, buff up the defenses here because... A couple bugs came by, but not too many. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe at some point. This is my train track. Where's the train at right now? Yeah, here's the train. Unload my train friend. <laughs> so cool. I love it. Um... Factor has another unique thing about it. The other three factory games have effectively uh, limitless resources. Your ore fields will run out in Factorio. This is a cozy map spawn, way better than your other spawns. Actually, this one was the most stressful start, but then now we've gotten to the point when it's cozy. <laughs> but I had to go in and kill, like, there were bases, like, here and here and here and here and here and here and here. And I had to go in and get rid of those. And now it's cozy, which is very, very, very nice. I also think that I have just, I built a larger factory. Let's look at my resources. Still have like 100k. Oh, can I look? A bunch of these guys came in. Oh, actually, we are getting attacked here sometimes. I don't know where those came from. It's kind of odd that they ran in right there. Maybe they ran all the way over here and ran in there. So I guess I do need to beef up the defenses right there. All right. Um, I hope to be able to, I hope to be able to watch the flamethrower do its thing though. So let me, let me go in here on my car and tempt fade a little bit. <laughs> I think I have a car. Yeah, I have a car. So let's get in my car, put some fuel in the car. And let's go poke this base and then run back here and see what the flamethrowers do. <laughs> Surely it'll be fine, right? Oh yeah, this was a base I destroyed. Alright, here they come! <laughs> here they come! Go, flamethrower, go! Oh, there goes the flamethrower, yeah! <laughs> Ben. Sick. All right, that was everything I hoped it would be. Uh, but turrets track their individual total. Let's you see the MVP turrets. All right. That sounds great. How many kills do you have, turret? Whoops. That one has 11 kills. Well, that's just lots of fun. All right, I think we're quite safe up here now. Let's, um, let's um, actually get some safety down in the south area. And then I think our base will be fine. And next, I think let's try to get uranium. Oh my God, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to snake a train. I probably take out this base, snake a train in here. And then we can get that uranium. Is that the best source of, is that the, uh, no, I thought that was uranium right there. Is that the only source of uranium? There's also some nice coal over there that we might want to get at some point. What else do we have? There's a little iron ore here. I think I should probably get it just cause, but I also have 4 million iron right there. Hmm. Uranium. <laughs> I don't know what else to do. Well, there's, there's actually lots of stuff I should probably build. So I think all I'll do is expand the base and then Maybe go try to get uranium. Well, actually, wait. Yeah, because the thing is, is that in order to make a chemical science pack, we need to get sulfur. And in order to get sulfur, I lied. It's not uranium. In order to get... No, we don't need uranium. I'm stupid. For some reason, I thought the sulfur needed it. We just need water and petroleum gas. Never mind. We'll g so the next thing we'll do is make the um, chemical science pack. That's what we need to do. I'm done. All right, let's get some turrets set up here. Um, I need to go get cogs. 
me go get some cogs. There we go. Now we can craft lots of turrets. The only thing missing is steel plates. There we go. We can craft lots of turrets. And that will be good. Do I have a flamethrower? No, let's make another let's make another three flamethrowers down here. Yeah. At some point I need to load them with more ammo than this, but for right now, let's do this. The blue juice is only one big step away. We have oil. But maybe not too big, I hope. How's that turret coverage? Yeah, let's put more turrets here. Blue juice is where lots of players fold. <laughs> is, uh, wait, do I have blue juice? Yeah. Hmm. Engine units will be difficult to craft. Advanced circuits. Plastic bars I make with petroleum. So it looks like I need to get a lot of petroleum, which we should be able to do with the oil. I have the oil in the base. That's a big plus from last time. Oh, I ran out of, or wait, I ran out of cogs again. Let's go slurp some cogs off the line. The remnants of the early game. Oh, we got all this oil. Blue science juice. More cogs, please. Thank you. Stop making cogs. You don't need them anymore. Will this auto update? I wonder. Will it still make the wheels? Um, I also need more iron. I got those. I got those. Looks like I'm pretty good at everything else. I can make a rocket and a rocket launcher. Oh my god. We need to blow ourselves up with the rocket launcher. And we can make landmines. That'll definitely blow myself up. And we can make modular armor. I wonder... Um, resistances. I wonder if the modular armor has more resistance. It looks like it has more explosion resistance. But we can also put modules into it at some point or another. Hmm. Very cool. Definitely want to get that. Uh, what's our turret coverage look like? We need one more set of turrets, like right here-ish. Yeah, I need one more set of turrets right here. And then we need a couple flamethrowers, and then we have a massive area to build in. Let's get some flamethrowers cooking. Do I have any yet? Nope, but it's about to finish. Oh, I suppose I should go get the oil. Why are you making cogs? I have them. Silly thing. Okay. Um, definitely need one down here. Since there's lots of nerds down here. So let's put this here. Oh no, this is under attack. Hey, they're killing my oil. Okay, I guess I gotta go defend that better. Heck. Let's go get these nerds. Oh, you don't have coal in you. Go! Stop it! Stop that! Come on! What a nerd! Did you destroy my pump jacks? Yeah, you did. What a nerd. What an absolute nerd. Alright, we gotta defend this more because if this goes down, then we lose all of our oil production. They destroy these pipes. There we go. Those are all working again. Let's make another set of turrets up here. And then let's make more turrets. Can't make more turrets. Oh, I'm limited by copper. All right. Well, hopefully that'll stop that from happening again.
Put the radar at oil? Yeah, we gotta put a radar here. Gotta put the radars everywhere. I wanna slowly get the radars everywhere. Nice, we're actually not running out of power somehow. Cool. Oh, I didn't have much ammo in these. Let's finish off our ammo in these. All right. Probably should put some ammo in the car. Y'all know I'm just gonna run into the car and crash, so. Ah! I should make a gate. Can the car go through a gate? I should try it. I should do some gates. Um, do we actually get attacked here? We did, but the this thing wasn't up. All right, we gotta get that up and running. Oh God, don't! Just <laughs> oh, I'm gonna smash the base. We all know what's gonna happen. It's inevitable. I need to get copper. That's what I need have that over here. Yeah, I have that. Do I also need more cogs? Always. We're gonna, so we're gonna have to automate engine production and then figure out what to do with all the oil. That'll be the next thing we learn. And let's get some oil down here. Maybe from one of these. Let's run a pipe down this way. Connect those guys up again. Does that work? Oh, it does work. Cool. Um, let's let's see. We have one flamethrower like this. Let's put another flamethrower like over here. Yeah, something like this. Slightly offset from the other one. <laughs> Yeah, there we go. Need some more underground pipes, and then let's put one more flamethrower turret over here. Maybe I need a, f I actually might need four flamethrowers now that I look at it. Is that lower? Yeah, it's like right here. Might need another one. I hate everything. There we go. I may I may decide to put another one over there. I'm not sure yet. Okay, we got that flamethrower. At least 30 flamethrowers. <laughs> More flamethrowers. Nice. All right. Cool. All right, so we have the flamethrowers up here. Get the flamethrowers up here. The flamethrowers up here. Maybe I could put a flamethrower up here. Or do I have one actually? I do have a flamethrower up here as well. We're looking really good. If I do say so myself, we have our first automated train set up, which is currently loading up iron over here very slowly. Why is it so slow? Oh, because it's night and the power is off, I think. Yeah, because it's night and the power is off. That's why they're moving so slow. And then the radar just went offline. I see they were like draining the last of the power. So um, finding some way to get some automated coal production up here would be good. I could have um, I could have them load up the train. Ooh, hold on a second. <laughs> what do we have here? Hello, friends. <laughs> They're gonna just evaporate. Flamethrower. <laughs> All right. Anyway, um, 
Yeah, I might want some... Oh, maybe I just make an energy storage thing with the solar panels. I believe I have the technology for that. It's called an accumulator. What would that be under logistics? Do I have the tech for that yet? Oh, it's being researched right now. Electric energy accumulators. So once I have that, then we can solve that problem. Nice. Burn the ball. I actually need to put more ammo in these guys because these guys are pretty often under attack. Okay. Uh, let's put more ammo in those. And then I think we'll... Um, I think our base will be set. Why do I need some more ammo? Yeah, let's go snag some more ammo. Oh, I actually do want you to stock up more ammo. Yeah, stock up lots of ammo for me, please. We got plenty of it. And then I think I need more... Oh, we limited by red. Now we're limited by red. Oh god, and I don't have a way to make more. <laughs> um, yeah, we're limited by red science juice. How am I going to solve that problem? See, this is where like I needed to expand my base more at the beginning. Well, red science juice just needs cogs and copper. So all I have to do is run a line of copper somewhere. And now I have all this room. I can... I don't even need this here. I can do whatever right here. Because we got cogs right here and copper. Uh, we got co copper right here, cogs right here. We're good. We'll just make more right here and then we'll filter it back up there. More red science juice. The factory must grow. Am I sustaining or growing? It must grow. Yeah, the main thing that I wanted to do is get defenses up that allowed us to expand. So now we have the room to expand. We can expand everything. We're going to run out of resources at some point, though. That's where it's going to get tricky. But for now... For now... Let me go steal some belts. No, 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 no. I'll steal these belts. Thank you. Um... Let's... Run that down here. And now I can do some more stuff with this copper. Alright, now we have copper to do stuff with. Um... I want... Maybe I should just make another... I have the plates right here. I think I'm just going to make more... I'm just going to use these plates, I think, and make more, um... Oh, this is so cool. We have room to do everything we want now. Let's get these guys. Maybe this should actually be a little lower. We can just make more here. Love it. Oh yeah, we'll do oil things too, but let's just get this building and then we'll worry about that. Right. And there's limitless space to keep growing however we need to. So that is good. And by limitless, I mean limited, but it's limitless in comparison to what we've put up with so far. So I am happy about it. Let's make cogs. What am I doing again? <laughs> I'm making more red science juice. Yeah. Okay. And then we got the copper plates right there. There's everything we need. Let's make some more red science juice. More red science juice. And maybe I should expand this and make like more, more, more red science juice. But for now, I'm just going to be happy with like double our previous production of red science juice. We got four of them. Let's just double it. And I meant you to adjust it. I don't know about the like ratios of these things. Uh, let's do an inserter. And a long inserter into each of them. 
Oh, they kind of... I should space them out. Huh. Are we actually finished on research for now? Speed module makes the machine work faster but increases its energy consumption. Productivity module. Efficiency module. Reduces the energy consumption. Uh, allows the machine to make more products from the same number of ingredients but also increases the energy consumption and reduces speed. Portable solar panels. Interesting. Uh, follow a robot count one. I'm gonna get the weapon shooting speed because that feels important, but we're kind of running out of everything that we can currently make, so let's just make the last of the stuff. But we're gonna need red for everything. We'll always need red. Um, yeah, we'll always need red, so more red production's good. There is space. Um, oh, the reason that I was saying space was because of power, but I do have the bigger power lines now. Maybe that solves that problem. The medium power line. Eh, it still kind of doesn't. <laughs> oh, I guess it's still, I guess it does. No, it kind of doesn't. Wait, it does. I don't know. Um. Yeah. I just wanted space for the power lines. So I, I wanted to move them over a little bit. Um. Right, more inserters. Oh, I've got them facing the wrong way as always. Or do I? Yeah, I do, I do. <laughs> That's the problem, more red science juice. More red science juice. There we go. And then what are we gonna do with that red science juice? Probably should have put these below and made it go up, but whatever, here we are. The spaghetti continues. <laughs> Cause I have to wrap these around. Oh no, it's gross. Oh my God. <laughs> the spaghetti must grow. Um, I need a ton of belts. Steal some belts. Thank you. Thank you. The spaghetti must grow. Oh, I can actually run them through here, right? That sounds even more spaghetti filled, which I like. <laughs> more spaghetti. Can't stop me. Okay, where do I need to get these? <laughs> I need to get them over here or something. Over there. Sick. Let the spaghetti continue. Mm. The more spaghetti this factory is, the better. IMO. Oh yeah, look at this. This is like added spaghetti. Oh, does it not work? Oh, <laughs> uh, I just I want it to be even more spaghetti. I think this works, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, your beautiful spaghetti factory. Mm. Beautiful spaghetti factory. Oh, we're like totally, we're totally stacked up on everything. I think we need to expand the labs now, which I actually made room for. Let the record show. I made room to expand the labs. The underground belts are longer. I wish they had more biological stuff, like growing plants. Yeah, me too, DT. Uh, the one thing I don't like about this game is it's like, you know, it's like crude, unbridled industry or whatever. Like, it, I want someone to make a game like this that has, I don't know, like, more diverse, modern stuff that you can build. I think that would be cool. Um, probably I should have this line go up and something. I don't know, but whatever. I do hear there's some space stuff in this, which I am excited for. Nice. More, more 
labs, more science. But I mean, the flame doors are pretty cool, and the trains are pretty cool. Alright, let's go. There's like way too many inserters. <laughs> it's fine. Yeah, that's like, that's, that's pretty good. That's good stuff right there. Do I need any more grenades? Nope, I got 260. Do I need any more red ammo? Yes, I do. Fill up on red ammo, there we go. Do I need any more walls? Nope. But yeah, those are just like slightly injured walls, slightly injured turret. I do need more turrets in general though. 20 sounds good. Nice. <sighs> Oh yeah, I need to go refuel this stuff up here, and then I think we're gonna be in pretty good shape. Can I just zoom in and check ammo? I can. I guess you guys need more ammo. There's some bugs coming in up there. So let's refuel that. Maybe now we can make an ammo belt. I feel like we're getting to the point where an ammo belt might start to make sense here. Yeah, let's just go refuel everything, and then, and then I think our defenses will be pretty nice. Biochemist Matrix. <laughs> Have you seen the flamethrowers? We did. We saw the flamethrowers go pew pew pew. Oh, there they go. <laughs> yeah, get them. I want everything to have like 30 ammo in it, and then I will not have to micromanage it hardly at all. That'll be enough ammo for quite a while. Let's see if the radars are finding anything new. There's another massive iron patch over here. Tons of oil right there. We have stone, uranium, copper. We have pretty much everything on our map now. So I think soon we will want to expand our production in all capacities. And then I guess, but I think the next, I think the very next thing we'll focus on is getting the new science juice. Cause we're gonna run out of things to research pretty soon here. need to refill you guys anymore definitely you guys are running low it's cool that these guys don't ever really run out of uh, oil at least it doesn't seem like they do I think they'd all have to be firing at once or something like that to run out I'm not quite sure how the oil consumption works Oh, maybe once I start diverting a lot of that oil for production, then they'll run out. Oh, you guys have way too many. One of these has like 70. How do I take half of that? There we go. Wait, no. Did I put half of mine in? Or no, I put it. Is there a hotkey to take half of it out? Um, that takes all of it out. What about control right click? Yeah. Control right click takes half it out. Okay, cool. Hey, you guys are super low. So I think you guys need, need more friends and then get these guys loaded up. Cool. That looks pretty good. Oh wait, did I forget these? forgot these but I think the base is pretty safe now got flamethrowers this isn't Greg tech uh, we're running out of iron quite a bit so that'll be something to fix running out of coal a little bit let's see we can get more coal here though That one was screwing me before because of iron. Let's not do that again. Please. 
Um, still got lots of coal up here. And we still have quite a bit of iron up here and over here as well. So I'm not too worried. Like, we're still plugged up on iron. And we got the 4 million iron from the train. So I'm not super concerned about getting every last little bit of this iron yet. But we'll, we'll put some more things in here to mine this soon. Uh, this is my first... This is my third attempt ever playing the game on Death World. Third day, I think. Um, maybe fourth day? Third day, fourth day. So I'm taking my time and learning new stuff. This is on Death World, so... If we die the other two times. I'm just happy to be alive right now. I made lots of space to grow. Alright. Um, I do want to have more turrets. Oh, that's actually pretty good. All right. Yeah, looking pretty good. All right, cool. Um, let's try to figure out how to produce oil stuff. Because that's what we're going to need next. And probably in a way that it looks... Um, in a way that we can make it nice and automated. So let's look at what we need for this exactly. To make the chemical science pack... We need to get sulfur. Let's figure out how to make sulfur. We need to combine water with petroleum gas. So I think that means we're going to have to also get some water in here. Um, since I have all my oil stuff right here, let's just go grab some water from over here with a... Wait, what's the difference between a pump and an offshore pump? Or is that the same thing? Pump is not the same thing. What is... Um. Pump. Hmm. The offshore pump is in here. There it is. What does the pump do? Pumping speed. I wonder what that does. Hmm. Well, anyway, we have the offshore pump. So let's take this. Get some water. I really, really need to use more hot bars. At some point in time. I don't need the boilers down here. Um, but I do need more pipes and things. So let me go snag some more pipes real quick, I guess. Well, hold on. We, okay, so we have water and oil right here. That sounds like what we need to make this work. So in order to make the sulfur, we need to make it in the chemical plant. Um, let's create a chemical plant. And while that's building, I'm going to go grab some more pipes and stuff. Thank the desi put water in the recipe so you won't start in a dry spot to redo it all later. Can there be a dry spot like that? That sounds horrible. Let's see. 200 iron gears. Do I need any circuits? No. Do I need any iron plates? Sure. Do I need any steel plates? Yeah. Do I need pipes? Follower robot count plus one. So we have a chemical plant now, I think. Uh, somewhere in here. Chemical plant is right here. So the chemical plant, I think we need to put water into it and oil into it at the same time. That would be my guess as to how this works. Did that take the oil away from that? It might have. Let's not do that. There we go. Fun question, let's see. I'm trying to see if there's some way I could tell if there was not oil coming to that. Hmm, don't know. I made a schween. Um, so you're gonna need power. Uh, 
Uh, that's gonna get in the way of some shit for sure. Uh, so it's gonna have to come out of you, so let's put that there. Oh, what's happening here? Alright, what does this do? I can make all sorts of stuff. I can make plastic and sulfur. I think I need to make both of those things. So I'm gonna need to also make one that assembles plastic. But for this one, I guess sulfur. But it needs petroleum gas. It doesn't need oil, it needs petroleum gas. Can I have you make petroleum gas? Petroleum gas comes from the oil refinery. So this is wrong. We want the oil refinery to be here. And then the oil refinery. Oh. Um. <laughs> Spaghetti. And the spaghetti begins. <laughs> no, all right. No, 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 no. I refuse to allow this to occur. I refuse to allow this to occur. Get all this shit out of here. Do it again and make it look anything different than that. Um. Okay, where were you at again? Oil refinery. All right. Oil needs to go into this from below, and then it'll go up there into that or something. Let this the spaghetti beckons. It does. <laughs> Oh, it totally does, though. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, so much nicer. <laughs> Then my power lines are trash, but let's not talk about that. Don't don't look at the power lines. Um, okay, now you can make petroleum gas. Fluid ingredient shortage. Fuck my life, I put it in backwards. Um, it comes out there, goes in there. How much shows three? Wait, are there three inputs? Oh, no, no, there's two inputs, right? Wait, that's, is this the right thing? I need more of these. All right, fluid ingredient shortage. Did I do it wrong again? Why is there a fluid ingredient shortage? Does it have to go right there? Why does it have to go right there, but it shows both when I'm placing it? I swear it shows both when I'm placing it. Am I crazy? It shows that one as being viable when I place it, and then it's not afterwards. What the heck? All right, there it goes. All right, now we get um, petroleum gas. It shows recipe specific inputs. Uh... Okay, now you can make, wait, do I? Yeah, I have water and this hooked up to you. So you can make sulfur. Yeah, we got sulfur, let's go. Sulfur production is a go. Um, okay, how do I get the sulfur? Is that just something that can be grabbed? Or a regular grabby grab? Yeah, we got sulfur, let's go. All right, I don't know what to do with the sulfur, but we'll figure out what to do with the sulfur. For now, let's just like stick it in a box or something. Box, big old box of sulfur. Big old box of sulfur. Okay, you stick it in there. Um, 
All right, what else do we need for new science juice? We're also gonna need to make advanced circuits. So we're gonna need to make plastic as well. While we're here, let's think about how to make plastic because I think it's at the same thing here. So we're gonna have to make another one of these that has both coal and petroleum gas. So that means we need to get a coal line over here. Uh, that's slightly more annoying, but we can get it from right here pretty easily. Gonna need an ass load of track though. Snap, steal some track over here. So let's make a splitter on this coal. And then let's get the coal over here. Now we have boatloads of coal to use. Which is making me think that we should probably go check on our coal input and increase it. Because I think we can increase it. Almost main belt. Is that like the secret tech? Uh, let's see. Hey, Flutter. Making some very nice progress here. Let's go ahead and add more coal into this. Do I have any drones? I do. Good enough. <laughs> Need more belts. So many more belts. So many more belts. Good enough. Should have moved them back one, huh? Whatever. It's enough. Cannot reach. Yay. All right. Now we have more coal. So our iron is running dry. Are we still using all the iron or do we need more iron? We actually do need more iron. Let's snag some more while we're here. At least get one nice one here. We can do that. We can get a couple more irons up here. And we have a lot of iron. Um, we have like limitless iron. Maybe I'll just make two trains. I don't know how the trains won't run into each other though. We have to figure that out eventually. I mean, I could just make two different tracks, but other than that, how to do it? Hmm. Are there any other miners that are not doing anything? We've still got limitless copper currently. do I want to do this? Maybe just like this would be good. Oh, that's good enough. That looks good enough. What's that? Oh, a power line. Uh, that should be enough iron for the time being. Wait, is this? Oh, these are like offset by one. I see the problem with that. Oh well, fix it some other day. Now we have a nice thing of coal coming in that we could use that. What do I need for building right now? Always need more iron. Need some more cogs. Need some more rails. Need some more belts. Any copper? No. Can repair that dude. Okay, we got our coal right here. 
Um, what are we going to need to do with the coal? The coal is going to have to go into making advanced circuits, I believe. No, it needs to go into making plastic. So how do we make plastic bars? Coal and petroleum gas made in the chemical plant. So I think that means we need an additional chemical plant. Why does sulfur production stop? Sulfur. I don't understand why that stopped. Um, how's our power, power still fine? So let's make another chemical plant. Oh, let's see. There's petroleum gas. There's there's extra petroleum gas, I believe. Yeah. So let's we can actually just take a branch off of this petroleum gas. The coal's gonna have to come up here though. But I think we can take an extra branch off of this petroleum gas. Or is that? Wait, which one makes the petroleum? You do. Is this full of petroleum or no? Cancel the recipe while looking at plastic. Heck. Let's see if this works. Uh, if I make another chemical plant. See if this works. Chemical plant. I wonder how many of these I'm gonna need. It's always more than you think. <laughs> it's always unlimited. How many? Yes. Okay, what are you gonna need to make plastic? You're going to need coal and that. So let's think about how to get the coal in there. I believe this means an inserter has to insert coal into it. Is that what it means? I don't know. <laughs> Random coal line, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Get line. Wait. Is this how it works? Sir? Puts coal into you? How many coal does it need? One coal per 20 petroleum gas. Oh, we're limited by petroleum gas. Output. No, no, no. We're limited by output. Output full. Um, Alright, so we need inserters to take. Take the plastic. Okay, cool. Now we're making plastic. Now we're making plastic. Got tons of sulfur coming in. We got plastic coming in. Let me see what's actually happening with the coal. It's not taking very much, I don't think. <clears throat> oh, petroleum. Fluid ingredient shortage. Fluid ingredient shortage. Okay, so we need to make a another chemical plant. Yeah, the problem is this thing. We need to make another chemical plant producing Petroleum here. So let's make another chemical plant. Portable solar panel. So many cool things to make. Oh wait, we need another oil refinery. <clears throat> let's make another oil refinery. But what are you doing to combat pollution? Uh, don't worry about it. <laughs> Um, make petroleum, please. Fluid ingredient shortage. Oh, it has to go into this side. That's right. What do you do, petroleum? For whatever reason, and then it comes out here. 
Well, let's just have it go into that same one right there, I guess. Okay, now are we limited by fluid ingredients still? My god, we're still limited? Did I do it right? So we need even more petroleum because it's getting used like immediately. Broke the other pipe. Oh, shit. Oh, I did break the other pipe. I see it right here. Oopsies. It's kind of hard for me to visually tell when I've done that, which is somewhat unfortunate. <laughs> There we go. There we go. All right. There we go. Output full. Fluid ingredient shortage. Still fluid ingredient shortage. Um, may need even more. I need even more. I think we need another one. <laughs> more oil refinery. Productivity module, huh? More refineries. should probably I don't know whatever whatever let's just keep plopping them down <laughs> it's fine everything's fine how don't you have power What? Oh, it goes in that one. I've learned nothing. Cannot connect systems with different fluids. What? Hello? What did I just do? God damn it. <laughs> Wait. Did I just kill the... No, it's still going. It's still refilling. It's still refilling. Oh, that's going all the way to there. Is that going all the way to there? What have I just done? What have I just done? All right, spaghetti it is. <laughs> spaghetti it is. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh my god, I hate this. I love this game. All right. Um, this needs to... Why is that there? I think that's fine. Please be fine. Okay, um, so that means I need the output here to go into there somewhere. Perfect. <laughs> Fucking giant spaghetti the spaghetti is getting so much worse and i'm here for it night vision equipment belt immunity insert into armor to prevent you from being moved by belts that's funny personal battery inserter capacity 
Energy shield inserted into armor to absorb damage. That sounds sick. Follower robot count to advanced oil processing. Hmm. All right. Let's research all the things. Oh, wait. One of those had blue. I can't get that one yet. Okay. We're almost running out of stuff to get. So that's why we need to finish this and get blue science stuff going. Okay. So that is no longer limited. Let's go. And this is output full. What? What did that mean? Oh, it needs a faster... Oh, there we go. That's way better. Oh, shit. That's way better, too. Oh, my God. Look at that production. There we go. Now we're producing. <laughs> Hell, yeah. Prediction has won 30 minutes in advance. What was it? But we set up an automatic train. Oh, did it actually? Did I set it up? I did set up an automatic train. I can't remember when I did it. That was ages ago. Uh, Perry clock both. <laughs> Literally both. All right. Um, you guys are getting... At some point, I'm going to get rid of this completely, but I'm just storing it for now because I don't know what I'm doing with it yet. UFO 50 does look great. Okay, what is the next thing we need for advanced circuits? Now we have plastic bars. We're going to need a bunch more copper cables, which we can get right here. We're going to need a bunch more copper cables and then a bunch more electronic circuits, which are more copper cables. So we just need to, we need an ass load of copper cables and then we need to get our iron supply which is pretty easy I think. There's our iron. Are uh, we need to maybe get more iron coming in or something? Or do I need to just balance it again cuz it's all I don't think it matters. I think there's plenty of iron for now. Okay. Cool. We got everything we need though. Ish. Oh, yeah, just having the base be like left to right is really, really, really working out well. Did that thing just spawn there? Pretty sure that wasn't there before. How are you guys doing on ammo? Everything seems fine. UFO 50 is actually some of the best. Um, and also not as good time I've had with video games. What? <laughs> I think we're gonna need a ton of copper wires, but it's hard to say exactly how many, so let's just start making some and see what happens, YOLO. And then let's, um, we're gonna need to mix the copper wires with, or the copper cables, I mean, with iron. So let's have the copper cables go downwards here. What is under attack? Um, does it matter if these are all right next to each other? I feel like five things of copper cables is good. Let's have this go to, am I gonna need more of those? I don't know, whatever. We can spaghetti it if we need it later. Let's do this. Copper cables. Always turn them the wrong way. Every single time. Then we'll get the copper cables. Put them down here. I need more belts and stuff. Um. So let's see. What am I going to do here exactly? Uh, we need... How many of these... I need to make... I also... I need a bunch of copper cables, but then I also need to make some electronic circuits. Um, Alright, Gigabrain. I think I have Gigabrain right now. I think I have Gigabrain. Uh, it might not be the right orientation here. Yeah, I need this to be one lower. Uh, one more lower. 
pretty sure Giga Brain. The Giga Brain is we make the electronic circuits. Because I need the electronic circuits and the copper cables, but I need to use copper cables for the electronic circuits. So you get iron to make that, and you get copper cables to make that, but then you put back the circuit. Yeah, you put back the circuits onto the same belt. Let's go. And now we have both of those things literally ready to go. We just have to line it up with our plastic, which is right there. So we just bring this up to the plastic. And we are cooking. Um, so let's make a couple of those. I don't know how many of these. What's the ratio here? It's two electronic circuits for four copper cables. So I do need more copper cables than electronic circuits. Um, probably I need to add more of a bunch of these. But this is at least a thing for now. Okay, let's decide on how to make more of this later. For now, let's bring this up here. And then these are the two things we need right here. So let's stop doing that. Let's take a bunch of plastic. I'll filter it back into this. Is that what we need? I can't remember if there's something else. Advanced circuits. Two plastic bars, four copper cables, two electronic circuits. This is the shit we need. Okay. So let's make... Let's use a long inserter. Oh, the long inserter's gotta grab two things, which isn't smart. <coughs> <coughs> Is the log inserter slower than another one? I assume it is. If that's the case, then let's um, spaghetti this shit. Do it like that instead. That didn't work. But it will work. Okay, it works. Um, it's faster than a basic and slower inserter, slower than a fast one. Since it has to grab two things, I figure I want the long one grabbing the plastic. But I don't know. Okay, we're gonna need a bunch of long inserters. I'll take some fast inserters. Oh, I gotta try the rocket launcher. Ten, I can make like night vision. Personal battery, portable solar panel, speed module. Do lots. I'll have to figure out how to do all that stuff. Okay, cool. Making red circuits. And for each one of these, we need you to be... I need you to be grabbing from there, and you to be grabbing from there. And let's use a fast one for, for this, because these guys need to grab pretty fast. So quiet. Nothing's really attacked us in a while. Let's go. Now we have Now we have red circuits. In order to make um Oh, we got to automate engine units. That's going to be hard. We still have to automate engine units, but I think I could do it. So we have the red circuits. We have the sulfur. We'll just bring the sulfur up there. We've almost got it. I am very proud of the progress that has been made. Get the sulfur there. 
That's what have broken my brain probably just yesterday trying to do this. And we're doing fine right now, I think. Alright, I'll worry more about lining these things up later. But we got the red circuits here. Sulfur here. And then the only other thing we need is the engine. Which... Yeah, we're schmoovin'. We need the engine. So we need <laughs> we need steel plate, iron gear wheel, and pipes. Okay, so this is gonna be tricky though. This is where it gets tricky, I feel. Let's go get what we need to make that happen. But I think we can make that happen because we have the gear wheels right here. So. Um. How are you guys from further away somehow? Uh, okay. We got the gear wheels here. <laughs> we got the gear wheels here. Where the fuck are my... Oh my god. We can make the pipes wherever. The pipes don't matter. What we need are these. Uh, what we need are... Oh, God. <laughs> Wait, I see a path. I see a path. <laughs> I see a path. <laughs> uh... <laughs> I see the path. Oh, my God. All right. We need to split this. We need to split this. You're coming with me. <laughs> Hello, you're coming with me. Oh, there we go. Yas. Where is it going? I don't fucking know, but it's gonna get there, damn it. All right. Oh, this is some hot spaghetti right here. Mmm, yeah, there we go. Theo's going on a fucking magical journey right now. Yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. Uh. And there's the steel. Easy. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> uh. There's the steel. Oh, yeah. Right on time. Right on time. Okay. Wait, what else do I need again? Okay, we need to make engines. So we need steel. That. Oh, we need pipes. Okay, still missing pipes. Still missing pipes. Everything has intended. <laughs> this is a scenario your own factory. My own factory. Clever man left just the right amount of gas. Um, I already have a pipe maker somewhere, but maybe I should make a different pipe maker. I have a pipe maker right here. But instead of belting the pipes all the way over there, let's just move the pipe maker somewhere where our iron is. Basically, we just need iron, right, for pipes? Uh, where the fuck are pipes? Where's everything in this game? Where are pipes? <laughs> it's gotta be here somewhere. There they are. It's just iron plates. Okay, we've already got the iron right here. Let's just bring in the iron. Speaking of which, um, I need to get... What am I limited on by this? Gear wheels. Um, let's pick up my gear wheels. My god, I need to drop off all this plastic and crap. Uh, let's siphon some... Belts from the line of belts on the belts. Okay, we got belts. Where do I want this? Maybe I want it over there, actually. What if I just split it here? Oh, yeah, there we go. 
We have all the components. Yes. Oh my god, it's so satisfying looking at all of them just leading into here. Yes, yes, very good. Okay, uh, one of you nerds has to make pipes, and then the rest of these fucking things go on a magical journey. You can't wait until trains. Do I have news for you? <laughs> Where is our train currently? Our train is currently being unloaded. <laughs> our train of iron. The beautiful iron, which is set up to automatically go over here and fill up on beautiful iron. Alright. Tr the trains are already here. Alright, let's see. Could the train be more efficient? Yes, but I don't care right now. We're doing other things. Uh, let's see. I need more of these. So we need to make pipes. So let's make some pipes and then dispense the pipes. Follower robots. I'm almost, this is the last piece of research that I don't, that I currently can even get right now. Um, all right, we're gonna need a bunch of pipes. So you can start making pipes. And then let's get some pipes. Pipes. I think that's everything. Uh, oh, we need to make engine units. That's right. Okay, so before we worry about this, we still need to make engine units. So what's the final thing that we're gonna need? We need advanced circuits, sulfur, and engine units. So we have advanced cir circuits, sulfur, advanced circuits, sulfur, uh, but can we do this like a smart person maybe, possibly? Can I combine these? Won't it just work like this? Wait, won't this just work? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, advanced circuits, sulfur, and then um, we made steel plates, iron gears, and pipes. So steel plates, iron gears, and pipes. I don't know how many pipes I'm gonna need, so let's just assume that I might need like one or two more pipes here. So let's do it like this. There we go. All right, cool. We got everything we need coming up here. Okay, um, looks like I'm gonna definitely, well, let's see, I don't understand, let's see. When it's making the engines, it does need more pipes than anything else. Um, so I think we're gonna want at least one more pipe producer here for now. Let's make one more. We can always expand this upwards if we need to. But let's go for at least one more. And how many iron plates does each one of these need? Wait. Why aren't you doing anything? What have I done wrong on this one? Oh, I just fall. The belt's full. Okay, that's fine. Uh, you nerds just need power. And to make those. Okay, great. Let's figure this out. Um, I think we'll make it like right here. Let's make engines. What's the ratio for this? It needs two engines, three circuits, and one sulfur. Um, let's start with three and then see how it goes. This game hurts your head. What does Q do? Oh yeah, I always forget to use Q. That's right, you can use it to grab, like if I want this inserter, rather than going and finding the inserter, I can just push Q on it and it gives me like the thing that I already, if, if I already have one sitting out. Um, so that's useful. We're gonna need to do long arm inserters as well. Cause the long arm inserters are gonna grab for that. These are gonna grab this. Uh, and it might not be efficient with grabbing two things from there. I'll figure it out later if we need to do that. For now, let's just get our beautiful product coming. And you're gonna make engines. Nice, and then here they go. Go, my pretties. Let's see what they get bottlenecked by. These are just bottlenecked by assemblers. We can fill them up easily enough. So the, the real bottleneck here is just assemblers. Okay, so they make engines. And then um, that means we're gonna need at least another assembler or two, I think. Do I have more of these guys? Yeah. Uh, All 
All right, we have the engines. We have all this stuff. Everything is wonderful. We have the spaghetti. There goes the spaghetti. Yes, we have everything we need. There we go. This right here is the stream of our dream. The dream stream. The dream stream. All right. Uh, 1999 Sam says, Carl, can I ask you a semi-science, semi-job related question? Absolutely, go ahead. Sorry, I haven't been um, reading chat too much because this is <laughs> this is so complicated from a brain hole. Um, I need to get some stuff out of my inventory real quick. So I'm going to have you dump all this sulfur back into the line. Thank you very much. Oh, mistakes are made. Stop! Mistakes were made. I'm going to put you here and have you dump all the sulfur back into the line. And then same thing here with plastic. Um, I'm gonna have you dump all the plastic back into the line. Just so it gets out of my inventory. Okay, and then we need to make what was that person's name? I don't want to miss their question. 1999. Um, this game hurts my head. Yeah, feel f whatever you ask. Take your time. Whatever you ask it, I'll try to look it by in chat. Feel free to scream at me if I forget something. I can't research anything else, so it is the perfect time to get blue science juice right now. So let's get blue science juice. Um, blue science juice. Oh, we can actually start making it. Maybe most efficient would be oh god stop <laughs> maybe most efficient would be right here even and then we can make it even right here start making it right here actually spacing stuff out is sometimes nice <laughs> at first i tried to make everything way too compact okay blue science juice is finally here what a glorious day it is uh, 1989 Sam says, so in May I graduated with a farm D and I'm currently waiting on exam results to get my license as a pharmacist. I'm really more interested in the research side of things though, and not sure how to go about getting into grad, uh, getting into research labs, grad school or academia as a career at this point. Uh, well, you could definitely do research outside of academia and I would probably suggest that if you want to make money. <laughs> <laughs> However, nonetheless, I really enjoy grad school. It's my favorite time in my entire life. And um, it can still be very enjoyable. And there still are academic opportunities or whatever. Like maybe you go to grad school for a while and then go get a job doing pharmacy research or whatever, some kind of research at a company. So um, as far as getting into grad school goes, like I don't think there's anything special or secret about it at all. Like you just find a school that you're interested in maybe find research from professors that you're interested in by looking at the websites of um various different grad schools and applying to them in general um i think if you have a background doing something then you're reasonably likely to get in so um let's see really much in research and not quite sure how to go about getting into research labs grad school or academia as a there's two engines not working heck i'll look for that in a second um do i have the things facing wrong yeah um i think it's very intimidating sounding but really not that hard to get into i don't know it does depend a little bit on what grad school you want to get into specifically but if you just read about the research of different professors and find stuff that interests you then you will show that interest naturally when you apply and they'll pick up on that. And so they will be very interested in having you. <laughs> um, I know many people who've gone to grad school like in their late twenties, thirties, even early forties, and it's totally fine. So yeah. Okay, are some of these engines not working? Uh, what's the error? Wait, why do I have red inserters right here? What am I doing right there? Okay. Um, is that the only problem? Science juice. Science juice. 
you are going to need a red inserter and a yellow inserter. Yeah, here we go. And now let's get delicious blue science juice. We've used so many belts. I need to go get some more belts. You have two assemblers not producing engines. Oh, let me go look at that. Heck. Uh, what do I need? I need you. I don't need copper. I need you. Um, I think that's mostly it. And I can also siphon off some of these for more belts. Okay, cool. Blue juice. I have two things not producing engines. Oh, literally not producing engines. Okay, cool. Let's see, Let's see the issue. And you guys are just waiting, right? Yeah, you're just waiting to make engines. Okay. All right, let the blue juice begin. Blue juice production has begun. All right, let's figure out how we're gonna get this blue juice over to my labs. Where are my labs at? Labs are over here. Well, that's easy enough. Let's get some more room in case we want more blue juice production in the future, and then we'll just come over here. Just run a massive belt, it's fine. I wonder if I can combine it with my other belt over there. I don't know. Um, I need more belts. What happens if I do that? Oh, come on, just pick it up. <laughs> All right, fine, we'll go here. Let the blue juice begin. All right, what's our first research we should get with our wonderful new blue juice? I need more power poles. Let's see what research is available to us now. We can get advanced soil processing. Laser! <laughs> Uh, that sounds good. Trains can slow faster, allowing them to stay at high speeds longer. That's pretty sick. Electric energy distribution. Uranium processing, advanced material processing, faster, more flexible furnaces. Lab research speed, maybe is the first thing we should get. Though we're limited by the juice itself, so maybe not. Um, advanced electronics, low density structures, very useful for spaceships. Mining productivity. Ooh, military sounds good. Flammables and explosives. Um, I'm probably gonna get projectile damage five. Follower robot count. First thing I'm gonna get is projectile damage five, I think. Oh, it is one of the more expensive ones. Yeah, it's one of the more expensive ones. It takes 500 juice, um, if I understand properly. So that one would take a while, but it seems crucial to warding off the bugs. I do want lasers. lasers but damage five feels like it's important to just never die I do like stronger explosives military three I want to see what it if I click it I think I can see what it gives us combat shotgun slow down capsule reduces the movement speed of affected enemies poison capsule there's some cool shit in there uh, mining productivity increases the yield from all mining drills and pump jacks that sounds nice too But um, yeah, I'm just gonna be boring and get the projectile damage because I think once that one is, once that one is good, then it will it'll keep us alive. We don't know what's gonna happen. Whatever happens, it'll keep us alive. And I gotta add, I just realized I never added any sort of a distribution thing here. Hello? Close enough. 
Okay, blue science juice production needs to be higher though. And we also need some way to distribute these down into here. Uh, maybe you need to turn around. Distribute the blue science juice that way. Get down to the bottom row. No, one of you has to be able to get it down to the bottom row. Um, either way, we need more blue science juice. So let's see if we can figure out a way to get more blue science juice. Feed it into the gray belt. I was thinking about that. Um, what's the bottleneck right now on blue science juice production? It looks like engines. So it may also just be straight up production as well. Because they have a bunch of engines in here. How many engines does it take? Two? So it loads up like an additional one. Uh, the engines look sketchy though. Uh, what's the bottleneck on engines? Just assemblers? Yeah, we have plenty of materials. The bottleneck is just assemblers. So let's add significantly more of both types of assembler. Let's add a bunch more of these and a bunch more of these. Let's see how that goes for us. We need long inserters. And I can just go steal regular inserters off the line. Also need more belts. I can steal all that stuff over here. Wait, where is it? Uh, here. Yeah, I just steal some of those. Um, yeah, this thing just needs a lot of assemblers, it seems like. Thankfully, we have the space for it. Okay, now more engines, potentially. Maybe I want to reverse the belt, outputting engines. Seems like... Hmm. Can I reverse part of it, maybe? What if I partially reverse it? Is that better or worse? <laughs> um, <laughs> I think I still need more engines. <laughs> uh, let's see if we're utilizing this. Let's let that cook for a second and see if we're utilizing the science juice. But I think I, I think I need more engines still. Um, it occurs to me that I can make engines on this side with the same things. And then, um, let's make like three more engines on this side and then just belt it or belt the engines around into here or something. Let's try that. We need more engines. Let's see, more long inserters, belts, regular inserters. I'm gonna need more power, aren't I? Hold on. Am I limited by power? We're very close to being limited by power, so I don't think I can do this right now. Let's get some power first. Um, let's see. We're still limited by blue juice right now. So blue juice production is still needed. Uh, we need more regular power though. But we got 14% of the way there. <clears throat> Thank you. 
Let's see. Do I have... <laughs> How am I going to get more power? Um, I guess I can just bring a pipe over here and do it right here. Also, I should add some solar power potentially. At some point here. Is there room for a pipe right there? Uh, let's bring a pipe right here. And... Why is this going all the way up here? <laughs> what? Why doesn't this just go like this? Bye, Jambone. Thanks for coming by. All right. Um, this is fine, Charlie. <laughs> it's beautiful. Wait, no, I need boilers. Oh, consumption. Is there a chance I need more offshore thingies? No, it still has so much more pumping speed. Wow, you can really get a lot out of those. Um... Okay, so we need more boilers and steam engines, especially. Uh, pipes. Oh, we don't have any more pipe. Shit. Give a pipe, too. That's something one place 20 hours ago, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> For solar power, you need a lot of space. I mean, I do have like all of this space <laughs> and all of this space. I'm so happy the game has slowed down, at least to the extent that I can just work on the base for a while. That feels really good. I feel like they did a really good job of balancing, even on Death World, I feel like they did a really good job of balancing like how fast the enemies actually attack you. Oh yeah, I do need this coal to come up here though. So let's split the coal up here. Does that work? That does not work. Um, let's do it like this. Brilliant. Let's do it like this. Marvelous. All right. Facing the wrong way, as always. <laughs> and let's get the steam engine. Hello? Oh, the tree's in the way. Please. Okay, we just lost power absolutely everywhere. Um. Nice. Now let's look at our power. Yeah, we've doubled our power production. Let's go. Cool. And uh, unexpectedly, by random chance, it occurs to me that we could continue the same design over here if we need it more. <laughs> All right, well, I think I have, let's see. I love what my base just actually works out. Wait, what's getting destroyed down here? I might be running out of, I might have, oh fuck. Oh, we have a problem. <laughs> we have a problem.
Is there no flamethrower there? I literally don't have any ammo on me. Uh-oh, these are the old bullets. Uh, serious mistakes have been made. That was good panic building. You gotta, you gotta admit that was some fucking good panic building. Um, where are my things? There we go. I remember I refilled like everything except that one. I think I refilled everything except that one. I was like, yeah, they never come there. I had grenades, by the way. I could have just blown them up with my grenades. Big biter. Look at that. They don't even take damage. I literally can't even hurt them with that. That's crazy. That's fucking crazy. Big biters. That's not good. That's why I'm getting physical projectile damage 5, by the way. That right there is fucking why I'm doing that. Holy shit. Um, all right then, let's uh, put a flamethrower here. <laughs> do these guys do more damage than me? Do you, they do eight plus 12. I do, it doesn't say how much I do. I might only do five plus three. So they do way more damage than me. Uh, do I have a flamethrower here? No, I don't. I think I put a flamethrower like everywhere else other than here. Let's put a flamethrower here. Yeah, let's uh, go ahead and put a flamethrower here. Let's get some oil. God, if I don't repair these, then I'm going to have broken ass walls and I hate it. But I hate throwing a grenade was such a mistake. They're also broken now. Oh, fuck it. to dump the broken walls. Maybe I'll repair them later. Okay, there's oil right there. Ross Nelson, thank you so much for the 26 months. We're making such good progress. We have a train. We have oil. We have the mystical blue science juice. We have a massive base. Get this crap out of here. My panic building. Okay. Where did you come from? Where's that oil coming from? What? Shouldn't it show me? Pipe to ground. Is it literally not coming up? Huh? Oh my god, it's literally not. Okay. So we can just put a flamethrower here. Flamethrower. Where do I want the flamethrower? Probably they were right there, so probably like that. Maybe I put it down here and then it can kind of get, can kind of cover everything. More pipe, please. There we go. Okay, now we got a flamethrower and an ass load of turrets. And let's make that wall one thicker. <laughs> Whew! Alright, projectile damage 5 is actually 50% done. That's very good news. Carl, that's your oil input to the entire base. Oh, did I do it backwards? Did I do it backwards? Is it draining? Um, remember three hours ago we laughed about losing a single pipe? <laughs> it's still being input, right? Oh. What? Wait. One second. <laughs> Where is the oil coming from? Comes in right here. 
Here's the oil input. Oh, wow, that almost broke right there. I just see. Oh, and now it has. I understand the problem. God, I can't see shit. so easy to just like fuck everything up it's hard to tell okay there it fills up it's a little hard to tell um whether the pipes are currently getting oil or not it's a little bit hard to tell it makes rebuilds faster that's cool 68 Um, oh, hey, yeah, that power pole is dead. Does that mean there's no power to the pumps? Is there some way to tell that? Can't I zoom in here because I have radar? I don't understand why I can't zoom in. Uh, oops. Yeah, I think there must not have been power. No power, no... <laughs> Hey, look, I can zoom in. Also, what the fuck? There's like a mega biter army coming at my ass over here. Let's see how it, let's see how they handle it. Let's just watch. Let's just casually watch. Oh, they're attacking my power pole. Get the fuck out. Oh, do they already die? I see more of them coming over here. Is the wall on, is my wall on fire or are they on fire? Oh, it was up here. Well, there's just a... All right. Looks like they got burnt up. Nice. Okay, let's try to understand why we're getting attacked again. Maybe it's just like this. I could go destroy this stuff super easily. And this is like going to be a problem eventually, but this is like a fucking... Look at that. <laughs> Fuck that. Uh, that's going to be a problem eventually here. That's for sure. Oh, I need to like, I need to put more ammo in those things there. Probably I should like do something more important more with this. But anyway, um, I think that we've made tremendous progress. We have, look at that. We even have some stockpiled sci blue science juice. Wait, where's our, what are we losing out on right now? Something's wrong here. The way I organize this. Um, let's go try to fix that real quick and then get smashed by our train. Yeah, we're gonna also need to start um, like adding some more copper and replenishing a couple of different things here. So blue science juice isn't getting down into these. Um, I probably need a better design for this shit. <laughs> You go from there, you go from there. Wait, I need to, let's just make it so that, oh, you go from there. Oh, you need to go from there. You need to go from there. You need to go from there. Okay. I might have fixed it, but I probably just need a better design on this. Thanks, Sugi. I'm very happy we got the blue science juice cooking here. That was a tricky one. Uh, but now that I've now I've cut these off from from red and green. <laughs> I just made this into such a spaghetti fest. Okay, I think I understand. If you take the black juice from there, black juice gets to this one 
and then if you put that in there, you put that in there, and you take from there. I think I got this. Then this one will get everything. And then I can make it so that you go there, you go there, you go there. You go there, you go there, you go there, you go there. Okay, that side will get everything now, I think. Um, wait, I'm going to do that. There we go. This one should get every I think I fixed this side. Then I'll try to fix the other side in a second. Just rip it up and move all the labs? Yeah, probably. <laughs> oh. But this is a puzzle. Um... Okay, let's... I think this might have... That might have fixed it. Uh, right now, we're still just... We're running out of blue juice anyway, so... Until I get more blue juice, it doesn't really matter that much. Um, and then, why didn't we get more blue juice? Oh, I think we got attacked, or I got distracted. Oh, we ran out of power, that's right. Let's finish this, and then let's see if that uh, solves our problem. We have a lot of engines. Why not? Oh, we don't have red circuits. Uh, problem right now is lack of red circuits. Red circuits are being bottlenecked by copper. Copper is being bottlenecked by copper production. Copper production is being bottlenecked by the fact that a bunch of our copper things just fucking died. But that's super easy to solve. We just need to. We have tons of copper. We just need to drill it. So let's drill some copper. that this will already be enough for our purposes here. Get that coal out of there. Um, okay, do we need more copper? Oh, we just needed more copper. I could make more plate production. Uh, I'm not too sure we're going to need it. Let's get some more miners, though, while we're at it. Can you ride the train? Wait, yes, I can ride the train. Roro, it's so good. I love the train so much. It's my favorite thing that we've done. Apparently I can get crushed by the train too, which is fun. So let's maybe not do that. Um, let's see. I can s maybe switch it back to manual. Wait, can, how do I make it go? I want it to, oh, here it comes. It's leaving anyway, yes. Come my train. There it goes. Here it comes. Yeah, let's go. And then it's unloading all the iron. But we can ride it. Here, let's get in the train. How fast does it take to unload? Oh god, it takes forever to unload. All right, let's just ride the train for fun. How do I switch this thing to... How do I switch it to manual? I'll switch it to manual for a second. Whee! <laughs> Here goes the train! Yeah, it gets all curvy over here. It gets all curvy and wiggly. I love the train so much. I just want to make more trains, but we needed science juice. Oh, we're out of, we're out of power right there. What the heck? Okay, I'm gonna ride the train backwards now. Yes. Go backwards, my slithery friend. Just press the play button in the stops list. Oh, okay, cool. Your track designer broke some rules. It's fine.
Okay, uh, let's put the train back on automatic. No path. Why does it say no path? Did I put it in the wrong place or something? What did I do? Because it overshot the station. There it goes. All right, cool. Yeah. All right, we got the projectile. We got level five projectile damage. That's huge. And I do enjoy more flammables. So let's get the better flammables next. Increase the damage of fire-based weaponry. Keep our defenses in good shape. Um, we're definitely running just straight up out of iron at their regular base here. But that's okay, we got four million at the train base. So maybe uh, next time we will want to optimize uh, looks like we're gonna need to start getting more resources in general though like I'm worried about the coal running out it probably won't run out for a while but maybe the next thing we should do is get some more trains going and then optimize the iron um, from the current train because it could definitely be more efficient it just kind of exists right now take that do I need anything else I could use some gears do I need uh, oh, I could use some of these too. Let's get some electric circuits, some gears. Overall though, very, very pleased with what we've done. We expanded our base massively. We are all the way up here now. All the way over here, we got flamethrowers, we got oil, we got a train station. I think we are looking in pretty good shape. Oh yeah, I have a massive think of sulfur here that I forgot to do something with. Uh, let's put the sulfur back into the line here. Take my sulfur, please. Thank you. Oh, let's put our science juice in there, too. I accidentally picked up a bunch of random stuff. What are we limited by right now? Red circuits. So we're going to have to make more red circuits, which is not hard. I just need to produce more red circuits. We got all the stuff right here. <clears throat> okay, cool. Produced 1,000 advanced circuits per hour. Let's go. Heck yeah. Um, sure, this will work, right? Let's make some more circuits. Uh, am I going to be able to power that? Yes, I am. More red circuits. And am I going to be able to, yeah, I'll be able to do it like this, right? Pretty sure that's gonna work. And you can just take those circuits and put them there. Okay, there's more red circuits, and then I can get even more more red circuits over here. Uh, wait, that's not gonna work. Okay, I probably need to do something else with them. Maybe I could put some down here or something. But anyway, we're gonna leave that till next time. Uh, still copper limited. Oh, I just realized that the copper wasn't coming through here. Wait a second. Yeah, what happened to copper? Where'd all my copper go? Do we need more plates or do we need more raw copper? Let's see, here come the plates. Oh yeah, we still got a bunch of these being used. A lot of plates are getting siphoned off for all this stuff. Yeah, okay, I think we just need more plate production. Why is the plate production limited? Plate production is not limited by copper ore, it's limited by actual output of plates. So that's easily solvable with uh, better copper refineries. So let's do that, get our better copper refineries. All right, so I think that'll solve that problem and might 
lead us to needing more copper input, which is also easy to accomplish. Let's just add a little bit more copper. Okay, that'll probably solve the copper issue. The next challenge is thriving. Hi, Janine. I should send it back to iron. And I am making quite a lot of these rounds, but I think I do need them. Oh my god, look at this glut of science juice. Yeah, we're in need of the more more blue science juice. Okay, so what's the let's see what let's see how many more copper get here now. Um build up of red so now the cop now more copper should start getting all the way over here if it doesn't then hey what the heck oh you're just not grabbing it okay but it'll get there eventually uh, we might still need even more copper than that let's see now now once once everything filled up now it's getting all the way through the line here I think that's gonna be enough copper let's see here it all comes right now here it all comes Wait, why aren't you output full? Oh, that did not work right. Um, shoot, you need to do this. There it goes. All right, that got fixed. Um, and then is this going? Wait, well, we still used all the copper. Do I still need even more copper? Maybe I do. Let's go make even more copper, I guess. Really? Let's see where the copper is being limited. Oh, wow. They're absolutely pulling it all off. I see. It's limited by input into here, isn't it? Um, yeah, it's limited by input into here. Uh, can we fix that? Hmm. Um, I think I can split it. Will that help? Unclear, that will help. Um, don't think it would help actually, based on what I'm seeing right there. Because right, right here, this is a solid line. I don't think you can get any more into it. So, um, I could pull more off of, and I don't know. Faster belts? Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's put faster belts on it. Good idea. There it goes. There it goes. Yeah, that helped. Make some more fast belts. Maybe we can finally get it all the way down. Yeah, there it goes. That was... But we need even more, don't we? Let's see. All right, but I think we're making a lot more copper plates now, which makes me want to at least go check and see if we've solved the problem downstream. Almost. There's certainly a lot more copper plates coming in now, and this might actually solve it. You had these belts? <laughs> yeah. I think they were expensive to build the last time I looked at them. Okay, it looks like we're gonna have, it looks like we're good now. These guys are gonna run out. Yeah, we're at we're at peak production here. This is fine. Uh, so okay, what's the next bottleneck? <laughs> what's the next bottleneck? It's definitely red circuits. Yeah, it's definitely red circuits. And red circuit production is simply bottlenecked by assembly time, assembler time, I think. So we just need more assemblers. I can put another stream of assemblers here. And then just feed the red circuits back over there. That seems like a good way to do it. 
so let's um let's make more of these nerds. Make a little mirror image of this should work, right? Quite a bit more. That should be good. Missing underground belt. Ah, get out of there! Underground belts. What the fuck did I just do? That have worked. I don't know why that doesn't work. That's weird. I'm pretty sure it'll work if I just do it manually. What the heck was that all about? Silly thing. Okay, now we have more of these. It's still only side loading onto a yellow. Oh, um, now we're limited by circuit production, which is limited by iron production, which is limited by the fact that the train's not here right now. <laughs> All right, next thing we're going to have to optimize is the train. <laughs> All right, we're going to have to optimize the train. And then I think once that train is optimized, we're going to run out of everything else and it's going to be great. It's going to be a giant catastrophe. Can't wait. Um, is there any more iron I can get right here? I believe there's, oh, it's oh, down there. There is some iron right there, but not a lot of iron. Yeah, we're like slow, the iron is just drying up here, slowly drying up. Okay, um, I think that will be it for today. And next time we will pick up with trying to optimize this train because there is all the iron we ever need just sitting right here. We just have to use it. So, um, I just need to make the train load and unload more efficiently, I think. Oh yeah, these guys are like out of power. That's right, Dur that's right. It's, I don't have enough, the, I need to go put the solar power storage thing here or just load this thing up with like petroleum or coal or whatever. All right, cool. Very good. Our third death world has gotten the furthest by far for one yellow belt on a copper line. Oh shit. There's a wait, wait, hold on, I'll fix it. There's something wrong with the copper. Let me go find it. What's on the copper? Is that why it got all backed up? Oh, the copper ore. But look at how much, <laughs> look at how much delicious copper we have. We're just, we're stalled out on um, iron right now. Oh, is there like a, I don't even see it. I don't even see it. Um, reds need to go all the way to where it side loads or input red <laughs> Udo Moss strikes again it does well anyway anyway uh, the tile itself emerges under a slower belt then speeds up oh oh you're just talking about this thing here is there one where's the yellow one but anyway it's yeah well, I guess we could fix it just so that I could have it done for later do you mean somewhere here? Uh, 
I don't know. I don't know. Anyway. Um. Oh, the problem is right here. So close. Let's see. Oh, ho, 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 look at that. Look at that. Wow, that makes such a huge difference. Holy shit. That makes such a massive difference. Holy crap. Oh my god, that's delicious. Alright, there we piled we piled up the copper again. <laughs> Alright, we gotta figure out how to do that with iron, because right now our iron production is crapola. But we'll do that next time. Thanks so much for coming out, everybody. Thank you again. Um Thank you very much, Ass Pepix, Ross Nelson, Seek Dante, Adepter, Sigi, Regmar. Anybody I missed? Much appreciated, everybody. This game is very fun. If you left with the one left, I would have lost my mind. Uh, Bacon, we're doing great. We're doing great. We have, like, flamethrowers and trains and stuff. It's going very, very well. Ooh, speaking of automation games, we're going to go raid somebody who is playing... Satisfactory and is an amazing streamer named Waffle Smacker. I'm sorry, Senator Boss. Thank you, Box. You too. Bye, everybody. Have a wonderful day.